Yeah, I've read that as well. The uh, PlayStation 2 like potential time save. I guess I'll just start. We can we can make up a. I think it starts here. We can make up a uh, prediction on the run, I guess, or during the run. Hey, Dor, thanks for the good luck. I'm doing pretty okay. I, I really can't complain. I slept too long again. Like, my sleep schedule is really not not great. But apart from that, I can't complain. Hey, Tanya, thanks for the good luck. Yeah, Miney as well. Welcome in. Hey, Mika. Also, thank you for the good luck. You're no limit, hey, cubing. Good. Everyone's here. Holy shit. Hope everyone is doing well. Anyone in chat know how to make games? Sadly, not me. I would love to be able to, but nope. My coding knowledge is like potato level. Sub 2 prediction. Um, I don't actually know what my PB is, is the issue. Like, I know I PB it in full series. And I know that's been like submitted as well. But I actually do not remember what the time is. Also, that's fair as well, Matthew. Yeah. <laughs> I, just, I just had to go live now because otherwise it would probably get too late. But yeah, that, that's that's a fair point. Taking a game design class in college, that's kind of sick. Oh, all I did in my computer science class was like learning how to code who wants to be a millionaire. And that was like really basic. Is this game loud enough, by the way? It's like somewhat quiet for me, so tell me if it's bad. I can adjust it. Um, hey, that sounds cool though, cubing. Uh, Ron, you want to help? Thank you. Good luck with making that game. Hey, Ewan as well. That's going okay. Thanks for asking. Actually, quite quite good even. We've reached the sub goal yesterday, so that's really sick. So that means I have to do full series 100%, which is fun. Yeah, I know how to play games as well. Every now and then, I guess. Uh, like, I, I know how to play them slowly. If you need if you need play testers. Thanks for the good luck, Oxen. Also, welcome in. Salut, indeed. Uh, comment ça va? It's not the French game, but still. 215 is my PB. Oh, 215. Is that RTA? No, that's RTA, right? Yeah, definitely not a sub 2 prediction then. That's, I'm not gonna beat that. We can just go for PB, sub 215 or so. Well, I take breaks, Mayo, no worries. No worries. But hey, it's, uh, it's gonna be a fun run. It's gonna be over like multiple days and multiple breaks and everything. But we'll see. I think it should be fun. But yeah, thanks for telling me that audio is good. That's good to know. Um, I mean, Hando has pretty much everything that any percent has. Like, it has all the tricks that uh, any percent has. Uh, what well, any percent has all the tricks that Hando has. So I don't really, I don't really mind doing any percent instead of 100%. It's just like collecting some extra things. But yeah, so it's a very, very valid question, <laughs> definitely. It's also requested at some point, so I work through my requested runs. Hey Donut, thanks for the good luck. When it's going for Hundo Crown, no, but welcome in Inverse. Uh, yeah, I probably take like two breaks. I'll probably break it up into three if that makes the most sense. We'll see, maybe even four, but yeah. Uh, I think that's just how HP3 looks, Stompot, but welcome in. Like, I'm not entirely sure, but I think that's actually just how HP3 looks. Um, yeah, let's hope so. Let's hope we get something about Awkward Legacy tomorrow. I kind of doubt it, but. Like, they've been keeping us in the dark for years now, essentially. Just just having occasional updates that they're postponing it. So I, I really doubt they have something, but we'll see. Yeah, three three or four sessions for full series Hunter. We'll see. Hey, Flamer, you're Polsky. You're Beaver as well. Hey, this game is fun. Any percent is also fun. Like, HP3 Xbox is actually a cool game to run. Don't bully this game. Hope you guys are doing well, though. Appreciate the good luck. Close run died. Did he? Don't tell me he forgot another crest. Because that would be kind of sad. And if he did, then. Oops, I slipped. And I hope it's at least not the same one that he forgot last run. Which I don't. Oh, he soft. Wait, he soft locked in HP6. That's quite, quite an achievement. How do you soft lock in HP6? That's interesting. That's my job usually finding those. I'm I'm a bit I'm a bit disappointed. Also, I love that emote. Good job, stream elements. That's a perfect emote for bullying someone. You know, the hard emote. <laughs> it's a it's a loving bullying. See, La laugh hate relationship with Beaver and HP3. Okay, let me put something. Sub to 15, loadless. Let's put that. I don't know how realistic that is. I know I can 
PB this game by a bit, but it also depends on like Scourge and uh, Lumos and all of that shenanigans. So we'll see. We'll see how realistic this prediction is, but feel free to get your points in. Yo, Foxy, welcome in. Good to see you around. The Hogwarts Express reached its destination. Yeah, go for it, Beaver. Wait, how would you do that even during a week of school? Like, watch the lessons on the side? <laughs> no, you have on-site classes, don't you? I mean, go for it. If you really want to do it before me, I don't really care, so feel free to do so. I can just tell you that I'm definitely going to do it that weekend, and I'll definitely finish it. <laughs> also, nice self-bully. Harry Sounds like the relationship between Harry and Malfoy. Now I'm pretty sure that's just a hate-hate relationship. I, I think you're reading too many fan fictions there, you know? <laughs> pretty sure the pretty sure that's not hard work. Yo, Kildare. Thank you for the good luck. Good afternoon to you as well. How's it going? Uh, that's the wrong freaking button. I know my menus in this game. Yo, Flo, thanks for the good luck. Yeah, I heard that you run uh, softlock somehow, which is really weird in HP6. Like, how do you even softlock in HP6? But thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate that. Welcome in everyone from from Flowstream. Hope it was fun at least, but that's some weird shit. Been replaying the PlayStation 2 games for the first time since you were young. Nice. Hey, that's actually perfectly fitting that I'll do them as well. Well, I mean, the Xbox games are slightly different, but they're pretty much the same. But enjoy your casual playthrough. That's pretty sick. Bringing back the nostalgia. <laughs> they don't play gobstones together. It's I'm it's so weird to me how gobstones is that big in the games. Like it doesn't even ever really appear in the mo in the books. Like I'm sure they mention it, but <laughs> I don't know. Gobstones is a stupid meme. Collected a crest, but I didn't go to your inventory. Wow, that was interesting. So it's essentially the vanishing car glitch of HP4 in HP6. Hmm. Yeah, I see. But that wouldn't be RTA though, right? Or do you just leave the timer running, Beaver? I mean, that's fair. If you really want to do that. Sounds fun. Okay, then. You cast oh, you said TA. Okay. Yeah, I'll fair enough. Come on. Cast yeah, that seems weird. I would love to see the clip from that. Like... That, I've never seen that before either, that's some weird shit. Have you at least tried, like, I know the run's probably over anyways because it loses too much time, but have you tried to just reload and, um, uh, and see if the, if the crest respawned at least, or was it just completely gone? Yeah, yeah, thanks for the countdown, though. Wasn't there, okay, that's some, that's some weird shit. At least it didn't happen in, like, a 100% full series or something. <laughs> That's some, uh, that's some fun stuff. All right, Ron, get out of my way. That was cool. Thanks for the good luck, Precise. Welcome in. Yeah, a series about gobstones, a TV show about gobstones. I mean, to be fair, they've made a TV show about chess, and it's good. So I feel like you can make it, like, you know, I mean, chess is a cool sport and all, but you would think it's not really exciting enough for a TV show. So I think with the right setting, they can probably make a decent show about, uh, about gobstones as well without it being boring yeah the gobstone gambit but please put in uh, the dudley actor as well also loadless works i haven't even paid attention to that i checked it like before the run but i should have double checked but it's the first time i'm looking at it that would be a good bingo goal for octofactor bingo that is a cool goal indeed, yeah, because you can unlock them in like different games on GBA, GBC, oops. Ow, I forgot that you have to do Protego and not like cast at it. Whoops, dude, why are you not hitting? Game. You're lame, welcome in. Rip chat sanity, dang. I mean, to be fair, watching Harry Potter runs, why are they not hitting? Fuck off. Watching Harry Potter runs does decrease your sanity, I'm sure about it. Running them definitely does. Please hit. Thank you. That was really dumb. That was really slow, but that's okay. I'm not resetting for that. My PB is so bad, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> like, I can beat that by a lot if I just get Glacier Skip. Yo, Sammy. Um, thanks for the bon chance. Appreciate that and welcome it. 
Yeah, what is this sanity? I mean, come on, everyone that's running Harry Potter games or watching them, we, we don't know what sanity is. Otherwise, we wouldn't be doing this, right? We, we talked about that before in chat, being slow is the first step to being fast. I, I know we talked about that at some point, because that's sometimes how it works in, like, a speedrun. Yo, Slav, with the nine months. Holy shit, that's a long time. Hello there. Hello there. Come on, German takes a speech. Mispronouncing the meme. Uh, thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Nice wizard card next to your name now. That's pretty sick. How's it going, Slav? Appreciate that a lot. So there's an entrance to a secret passage in here. Yes. Yep, secret passage. Indeed, there is young Harry, they say, when they're literally like two years older. <laughs> Fuck's sake, Fred and George. But let's let's have the Ron magic. Yeah, I don't know why they changed that. It's so it's so weird. German text to speech used to be so joyful and so and so happy. And now she's just super depressed. <laughs> I do like to stab inside. I mean, I do like this. Do I even go for the Marauder slide? Aha, uh -huh, I don't. I probably shouldn't, but the other trick is also dumb, so I might just go for it and try to get it. I'm really bad at the Marauder slide, though, but I think I'll give it a couple of minutes of t t testing if I can maybe get it. Questioning your life choices because you're sub for nine months? Yeah, that's reasonable. <laughs> Oops. Yo, Yoshi. Welcome in. Good to see you around. She ate the rotten egg. Yeah, maybe she's like forced to eat one of the rotten egg beans every day. Kind of like me. So, yeah, I can I can understand. <clears throat> oh, whoops. Hey, welcome in as well, Winter. It was really good, actually. Like, I, it's a run. It's, it's been a while, but we've gotten a run yesterday that I was like actually 100% happy with. Like, it was actually a good run. <laughs> uh, got 100% record in it, so... Definitely can't complain. Oh. Open frames. Not, not too bad though. Oh, that's why you're questioning your life decisions, I see. Oh, can you stop dropping please? That's so annoying. Friends must work together. Thanks for the good luck, Marco. Appreciate that. Yep, that's the best voice line in this game. It's so, like, the intro of this game is actually kind of weird. <laughs> Having those weird, like, voice lines. Oops. I mean, yeah, it, it went, like, a lot better than I thought it would, to be fair, Matthew. Like, the ha Hundo could have been anything. It could have been, well, that, apparently. Or it could have been, like, 30 minutes slower. If I would have just messed up chess a bit and, like, forgot stuff. M-I-G-3. Wait, which one is that? M-I-G. What does that stand for, actually? But, you know... I guess fair enough. Now you know at least, so don't don't have to play it anymore. Yeah, I'll go for this like a couple times. Maybe they're hinting towards a co-op HP game. Oh yeah, maybe HP4. Hinting towards HP4. <laughs> That's gotta be it. Wait, do you clip in here with Ron or Harry? I actually don't remember. Yo, Noble. Welcome in. No, I think it's Ron that you put in here, right? I mean, I don't think it matters. Ah, sliding to the side. Maybe. I'll give it, like, a couple more shots. Maybe we can make something happen. Yeah, he's always sliding to the side. I don't know how to prevent that. Maybe I have to dodge backwards instead of sidewards. Maybe that's how you prevent it. Yeah, we want, you want Harry to slide into the thing, essentially. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. This is a stupid trick. I don't care enough about it. Let's just do the old strat. <laughs> that still skips like a significant part of this room, actually. Uh, sadly not. You can in HP5, though. Crafty. In HP5, you can play as a uh, Gandalf. Yep. Dude, I don't see who. where we're going. Something like this, I think. Oops. Hopefully this works. I mean, Ron is like fully in the way, so there was no way that would work, but you know. This room is dumb. Does that mirror do anything? I don't think I that's close enough. This is really heavy. It is really heavy. Yo, Truva. I'm doing okay. I'm still, still quite happy with yesterday's run, so hopefully we can make something happen in HP3 today. But this... I don't know why I'm always having trouble with this. He just like this skip is so weird as well. I I hate this entire room. This entire room is fucking stupid. <laughs> In my opinion. 
And hey, Oliver as well, thanks for the good luck. See, now he grabs it. I, I didn't even move it much. It's just, like, I don't understand. Oh, well. At least we got there. At some point. Just took us a while. Also, still, apologies for the occasional frame drops. That's just Vodafone being Vodafone. They shouldn't be that bad, but I know they're annoying. Hey, Cosmic, welcome in. Yeah, I've never really done any percent runs of this. Like, the only time I've done them is usually during, like, trifectas and, uh, and during full series. Yeah, how's it going today, Cosmic? Another puzzle. Bully Vodafone is definitely accurate. That's definitely okay. Hmm. <laughs> Fair enough, Slav. Be free to rent in the chat. I have no idea what you're really talking about, but, you know. Fair enough. I see your points. Today's the day. Today's the day of what? Wait, I'm so I'm confused. Hello? I am pressing A. You can literally see at the bottom. <laughs> the fuck? No. I mean, today is definitely a day. That, that much I agree with. Oh, the Kinect game, I see. <laughs> the meme game. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting to see the Kinect game being played, actually. You haven't even noticed them? Okay, then at least they're like pretty small. That's good to know. I should just stop talking about them, but I, I do apologize in advance. Oops. The poor muscle strength. Harry climbing like just fully with his arms. He does that in every game though. He's just like not using his legs at all. It's, it's pretty sick. But yeah, it's really hard to actually climb up a rope like that. So it is it is pretty impressive. And I can still yeah, go to you as well. Yeah, that's why only Harry climbs up, because Ron would fall off, let's be honest. <laughs> the green suicide squad. Oh yeah, Creeper is still banned, isn't it? <laughs> so you gotta give it a different name. Yeah, that's, you know, b blowing up the Vodafone uh, connection would be great. I would be down. I was about to say headquarters, but that can probably, that's probably against the TOS saying that. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't blow up someone's headquarters. You go. Yeah, no, climbing up a rope just just straight up is really hard, actually. Like, that is really rough. Yo, Chirp, thanks for the good luck and welcome in. And enjoy the pleasant weather, that's totally fair. Maybe see you later. I'm, I'm gonna stream for a while, yeah. We, we finish this run, hopefully with a PB. It all depends on glaciers. And then uh, we do some HP1 memes. Yo, Jumbo as well. Thank you for the good luck. Hope uh, you had a good day so far. Ooh, that's awesome, Truva. So I guess to uh, learn or like practice English a bit. That's that's what I've always what I'm always saying as well. Like, um, talking to actual people helps so much to improve English or to you know to get better at, at speaking it. Actually, I mean it's gonna be mirrored max percent. That is kind of torture. Let's be real. Yo, fiber as well. That's been a while since I've seen your name around as well. Thank you for joining in today. How's it going? Appreciate the good quick as well. <laughs> Just waking up there. Yeah, I honestly, my sleep... What the fuck? This is not normal. My sleep schedule has been so broken as well that I've... I have to admit, I haven't... I, I woke up not super long ago either. <laughs> but I try to fix that hopefully soon-ish. Maybe with the uh, trifecta on the weekend. That's gonna be long. I should not try this. This was just a bad cycle and we have to live with it. <laughs> Practice and improving your speaking skills. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. That I, I, it's honestly for me, it's the the best way to like practice a language. So uh, nice, enjoy. Ooh, an IRL stream outside in the sun. That sounds really cool, actually. I couldn't do that because German internet, lol. But that sounds pretty awesome. Maybe one day, chirp. Maybe one day. Doing good, that's great to hear. Uh, I mean, so far it's treating me okay. Yeah, the troll part, at least we can skip like one of them. One of the troll sneak we can skip, but yeah, the, it's it's a dumb section. It has some cool strats though. But yeah, no, so far this game's treating me well. I'm just bad at it. Oh, that, see, that that's exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> An IRL speed run. Oh yeah, just running. I mean, honestly, running is pretty healthy, so maybe I should pick that up. Like actual running. Okay, the second try is fine. I'll take it. This is saving a minute or so, but again, we're, we're against the 305, so <laughs> kind of like, eh, it's not really the time I want to get, let's be honest. 
a very reasonable price. Oh, those splits might actually be from before Carpa and uh, and the other trick was found. Like, there's a skip to skip the entirety of the Carpa challenge and the entirety of... Um, what's the other challenge? Of the... Hogsmeade, that's how it's called. <laughs> Words. Did it for a bit, was quite fun, prefer cycling though. Oh yeah, yeah, oh, cycling, I should do more cycling, honestly. Just doing like cycling uh, around the city or so, that's always really cool. I've not done that for a long time. Alright, have a good one, Sherp. <laughs> always ends in rolling lately. Hey, speed rolling should be a sport, change my mind. Jogging right now in Central Park? Dang. That's pretty sick. But probably, yeah, I was about to say, but probably not the not the Central Park, right? Just the Central Park of your city, I assume. <laughs> yeah, there should be like... Uh, I don't actually know how much they save fiber, but it's, it's gonna be a nice return. Like, there should be, I think, half a minute, a half an hour at least. A free time save just by doing the the skips, which are like really easy. I'm I'm contemplating not even safety saving, but I also kind of want to finish the run and not lose it, so I might as well just save in the middle. Gonna replace your tires. Yeah, my 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 bike is like a little bit broken as well. Like it works, but it has seen better days, so to speak. Hermione. Yes. Hermione. What are the imposter Hufflepuffs? Yeah, they're not even purple. Oh, yeah, yeah, they're not even purple in this game. It's really annoying. The only real Hufflepuff is Purple Puff. Changed my mind. Is this even the correct floor? I just went in here because I couldn't go down further. I know this is correct, okay. I was just trusting the game to lead me there, but... Thankfully, this is right. Wait, is it right? Yeah, that's right. I always forget who teaches what in this game. <laughs> it's always like so confusing because it's different than PC. Uh, have, have I dropped more? Yeah, yeah. It's. Vote of. I honestly feel like they've literally made the connection even worse since I switched, because now it's just a couple of uh, a couple of more like just a couple more days that I'm at Vodafone, and I feel like they've literally made it even worse now. It's so fucking scummy, honestly. Fuck them. Imposter purple puff. Yep. Wait, why is this only gray? Is that a game crash? No, it's not. Okay. Interesting. Um, I actually do not know much about those levels, like B1 and B2, but uh, still, congrats to that. I'm sure you can improve that this year, I believe, uh, Truva. Why, why are they purple? Nobody really knows, honestly. Actually, nobody really knows. Uh, again, memory cards shouldn't be that expensive though, Rat, so that shouldn't be that much of an issue. But yeah, it's just a matter of buying it, of course, which sucks. But yeah, no nobody knows why they're purple in HP2, I think. Like, what I heard a lot is that yellow is apparently a difficult color to handle in programming, but I think that's kind of not the reason. <laughs> because they do have a lot of yellow in that game, so I think that's just kind of a bullshit excuse. Or, like, reason. But I don't know. I, I, I just believe that they wholeheartedly thought that Hufflepuff, Hufflepuff's color is just purple. That's that's what I think, honestly. Hey, Hermione actually in a good spot. I'm just so cold. Like, it literally makes no sense if yellow would be like any different than anything else. Dude, stop frames. This is so fucking BS, man. I'm sorry for that. Honestly, it's so annoying. Ah, fuck you, Vodafone. Actually, fucking worst company on the planet. Like, I got to a point where I support, like, Nestle more than Vodafone, and that's, like, <laughs> that's, a, that's a big statement. I mean, I don't support any of those, but at this point, I like them more than Vodafone. Purple is a better color than yellow? Yeah, that's fair. I, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't hate either color either. I don't think there is a color I really hate, but purple is a cool color. Yeah, it's like way before... Uh, that's what I'm saying, Oxen. Like, I, since I've switched, I think they just completely fucked over my connection and it's like really bad now. That's what I'm thinking. So it's like actually super scummy. It's like so fucking dumb. But oh well. Okay, uh, also worst part of the run. Let's see what we can do. 
the real question is why is it yellow and <laughs> yellow in the books and movies? Yep, the books and movies are doing it wrong. I agree. Ah, that was close, I think. I'm not sure, but it's it felt pretty close. How's it going, Melon? Do appreciate the good luck. Yeah, prediction is for PB essentially. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. That's good. I'll take it. Where's your place? Welcome in. Um. Yeah, good good job you didn't precise. You did the correct decision. <laughs> yeah, you can, you can look back in that at at that and like think to yourself that stuff worked out quite well. So that's nice. Purple is the color of royalty. Oh yeah, no, it's like purple blood and all, right? Or is that no? That's blue blood, isn't it? <laughs> Wait, I'm a bit confused. All right, cool. There we go. That was good. That was a good section. That's probably gonna put me ahead by quite a bit over my current PB, but that doesn't mean much. We can still screw that up. Kind of like this puzzle. Well, it's probably a cool puzzle if you don't cheese it by being hairy, because we're not we're not quite supposed to be hairy in this section. As you can probably tell by the next cutscene. Oh, come on. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up! Thank you. Got it. The glaciers fell oh, yeah, yeah. Because they had to... Didn't they make purple from, like, the blood of something or whatever? Yeah, yeah. That's why purple used to be pretty rough. Okay. Dude, what are my loads? Are those normal? Like, those gray screens, they happen so much right now. kind of don't like those. It's not cool. Oh, yeah, Erasmus. I know my school had that as well. It's like the exchange program, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's awesome. Enjoy your time in Ireland. That's pretty cool. Once you're in Europe. Hey, yo, Zcox. Welcome in. Thank you for the good luck. I, I'm actually happy with this start. It wasn't great, but it was a start. Oh, yeah, you want to spam this here. I don't know why. I think it reduces the lag or something. I'm not sure. I remember that, though. They're normal? Okay. I'm just kind of scared that my game is, is crashing soon. But, yeah, that's good to know. We need we do need Purple Puff and Hogwarts Legacy. They, ju they should just create, like, a fifth house. And then the janitor house as well. So they need six houses in Hogwarts Legacy. God, imagine they just make the game, like, super uncanon and everyone's pissed. <laughs> like a third house and a fifth house. Uh, a fifth and a sixth house or something. Make it completely not like the books. I mean, at this point, we still don't really know what they're going for. But I assume it's gonna be, like, canon. Canon HP. This puzzle is also pretty cool, I guess. It's very easy, but... As far as Harry Potter puzzles go, they're okay. Over here, Harry... She, she she said to Harry, who's like not even in the same room. Harry. Yeah, Hogwarts is only complete when there's like more than ten houses. Honestly, there's so many that should be added. Oh, what the fuck! Nice collision. Oh, I can't I can't call for Harry anymore. What? Why? I want to have Harry at my side during these these lava pits. That, that are just, like, way too dangerous for a freaking 13-year-old. Imagine that's your school task. You, like, you have to fight f fire salamanders and, like, get across lava. <laughs> just a normal day at Hogwarts. Yeah, maybe. Maybe Harry got Thanos snapped, so we can't call for him anymore. Uh, also, I love how they're just standing in the middle of the salamanders and don't give a shit. That sounds very much like... Ouch. Like, the AI in this game. They like to be very passive. At least they don't, like, actively screw you over, like, HP4 AI or something. No, I don't. I don't have Instagram. Nope. I only have... I have Discord, I have Twitter, I have Twitch, and YouTube. That's that's about it. Don't have a TikTok either. <laughs> I've, I've thought about it, but I don't know. <laughs> is, that, is that... Wait, is... Maybe my school was the weird one if we didn't have lava pits. That could be it. Hey, Gargoyle. Also, welcome in. Hello, hello. How's it going? I would be the head of the janitor house, probably, Emson. Let's be honest. 
And OnlyFans. Yeah, I do have an account on OnlyFans, actually. But that is uh, not active yet, of course. It's not that one, by the way. It's not Nixus Burner. That I think that one belongs to Sake. I don't know. I don't know for sure. Thanks for the good luck, Dino. Welcome in. We got a pretty solid skirt skip, so this is off to like a, an okay start. But how's it going? American education system full of lava pits. Hey, at least you, you learn quickly that life is no joke, I guess, this that way. Your online course is absolutely nothing posted so far. Fun. I assume it starts tomorrow. Wait, why do I keep on saying skirt skip? Glacier skip. I don't know why I keep on saying that. I said that earlier as well. <laughs> I, I don't know. You know what I'm talking about. Not bad. That's great to you. Oh yeah, congrats on the HP2 PB I think you got, right? I think I saw that. GG's on that, that's pretty good. Right before the tournament, essentially. Looks better than PlayStation 2, dang. I actually... actually don't think I've ever seen the PlayStation 2 version of this. Wait, what? what is happening? That was weird. <laughs> but I'm, I mean, I'm not too surprised. I guess the Xbox is like a, quite a bit more powerful after all, so yeah. Yeah, sorry for keep saying skirt skip. I, I, I know this game. I know what skips exist, of course. Like, life's no joke and full of lava. Yeah, that's what you learn, and that's a completely, completely true. Completely true stand statement. Yeah, this boss fight is really random. Like, this boss fight is really weird. Oh, come on, Omani, please. Aim at that. Like, that's what I... I'm not a big fan of those weird boss fights. I, I'm really looking forward to HP2, by the way. That's tomorrow, HP2 Xbox. I have not done that in so long. I don't know if I can even do the skips, but I have to learn them for like Hundo Trifecta. By three seconds? Hey, PB is a PB, you know? GG's. Wait, you just forgot a crest? <laughs> okay, that's <laughs> that's great. So it's not a weird random glitch. Which one was it this time? Um, can you please work? Hello? Okay. So you got didn't show though? That is weird, yeah. But that was okay, interesting. That is still weird, but at least it's not a crest soft look. PC is better than Xbox and PlayStation. I agree. I, I prefer the PC version to this, but I think this game is still pretty decent. This game is quite fun. The one you have to repair next to the Slytherin Courtyard. Oh, that one? Ah, oh, dang. That's a weird one to miss, but yep, happens. Hmm, solid eight minute time save. Okay. <laughs> uh, for the time being, yeah. Uh, for the time being, full series 100% is on, on Xbox, but I think they are finding new stuff for PlayStation 2 routing, so we who knows? Like, I don't know how much faster Xbox is over PlayStation 2. Like, I don't know how much they have to find to make that faster. We'll see, I guess. Maybe it would be better if they make that faster, because that means... Um, that means we wouldn't have to do freaking AV4 skip and, like, no Xbox gnomes and everything. By a lot RTA. Yeah, but who knows how long it's gonna stay RTA, right? Because I think the trifecta should hopefully soon be loadless. <laughs> like you would think they would have switched to loadless a long time ago, but 6th gen mods never do anything, so, you know, might take a while. Thirty minutes loadless? Okay, that's that's quite a bit. Oh yeah, Flo is a 6th gen mod now, whoops, <laughs> I forgot. I don't know, it's just it just takes so long for anything to happen in 6th in, in, uh, gen. Just always. Uh, yeah, I mean, quite a few, Trevor. There's, uh, I don't actually know where that's from, but I, th I think that's like 19, in the 1990s or so. Wait, we have to go down, I'm an idiot. I mean, if you want to retime everything, it's literally two runs on the leaderboard, isn't it? For for Xbox trifecta. <laughs> like, that's not that much. There's a big Hundo time save in, in HP2 PlayStation 2? Oh yeah, 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 that's the thing. But is it, if it, does it save like 30 seconds, uh, 30 minutes is the question. Like, it might be a big save, but is it gonna be that much? Like, I don't know. 
I hope, I kind of hope so, because again, it would be great in full series if we wouldn't have to do Xbox HP2. Saves 20, okay, so it's still not quite enough then, I see. Yeah, that would be great, Flo, I agree, that would be awesome. So it wouldn't have to be retimed, like, after the fact, but I still think it should be retimed after the fact, as a trifecta. It's kind of weird to have that RTA while everything else is loadless. Yo, Kira. Thank you for the good luck. Um, I appreciate it. I'll need it. How's it going? So far, it's a good start, though. I mean, again, the splits are just completely fucked, so don't mind the splits. Wait, is are those my glitchless times, actually? Don't I have a 305 glitchless? Maybe that's completely wrong. Probably completely wrong. That's kind of weird. Maybe I just forgot to save my splits properly. That might be it. And Ehrlich, thanks for the good luck as well. Welcome in. Why am I going from this side? That's kind of weird. Bring here. Yeah, yeah. Calm down, Lord Farquhart. Uh, you have not mentioned that. Manual saving is nice, though. That's good for this game as well. And for HP1 Xbox, enables like so many strats. Manual saving is the best. Right, Mr. Weasley. If you pay attention. Is Snape just bullying his own class, by the way? When he says, like, you might actually learn something, does he mean, you know, usually in his class he, you don't learn anything? <laughs> Come on, Snape, don't do that to your own class. Oh my glitch, this is a 251. That could be loadless, though. So this could still be the glitchless, I guess. Like, RTA 305, loadless 251, maybe? I'm not sure. I will let Mr. Weasley give you a the bean? The bean is because Ron keeps on yelling a bean in HP4. And it's a golden bean for gold splits. Yeah, this, this entire lesson is super dumb. Ron just randomly throws the potion at Harry for no reason. Like, he just, I don't even know what he's doing in the cutscene. He just panics, I guess, and like, knocks it over. Yep, that is Snape. I think that's a good method of teaching kids, though, you know? Knowledge through fear. I like that. Nope, Goyle wasn't sure if he should spawn in or not. <laughs> uh, yeah, there we are. Wait, glitchless... Yeah, see? 305.16 RTA. So this is actually my glitchless time. That is kind of weird. Also, do I split here? I don't actually think I do. I probably split, like, once I get out or something. I assume we end the day after this, right? Yeah, probably. Yeah, so this is absolutely comparing to my glitcher splits. Interesting. I must have, like, saved them over my any percent splits or something. Why Snape? Snape's character model is the weirdest of them all. I mean, they have blonde Hermione and Ron and Harry don't look like they do in the movies either, but Snape is just so messed up. I don't actually know why. I feel like maybe because they didn't have the PC character models. Like, all of the other ones are the same as on PC, right? I don't know which which company made them, but he's just not in PC. So I think maybe they had to make him from scratch, and that's why he looks so fucking shit. I don't know. That's my guess. Ravenclaw. Uh, it's a 215. 215.20 or so, actually loadless. Ron is mouth for polyjuice for the entire game, dude. That would be that would be five hat. Like, du during the... P oh, yeah, I mean, he... Yeah, that actually, maybe. Since he throws the potion at Harry, maybe that's a sign that he I is. To worry about Dude, Malfoy is the ultimate imposter. Holy mind. shit. But he had plenty of other things um, to think about as well. You've got to help Neville. That's fair, yeah. Neville fair enough, though. How is the status on HP1 loadless even? I thought it was done, actually, but it never, like, really published. Your muscles feel older than the actual age. Yeah, I feel you on that as well. My body feels older than I am as well. <laughs> That's probably my fault. Uh, I mean, only if there is a tool, though, to be fair, Flo. You can't really retime all of HP1 on your own without the tool. That's kind of... That's not fair. NA Spectre, welcome in. The red looks sus? Nah, I don't think... I think it's just a normal red. How can a red be sus, right? Yeah, it's also the raid message, exactly, Truva. A bean. And the bit message. 
there aren't that many runs. Yeah, but still, I mean, it's like, what, 15 or so? It's still quite a bit. Neville and the Ghoul. That is Muggle Studies. That is here. I always forget which floor it's on. I always think it's like the fourth floor, but whatever. Also, that sucks to you, Yoshi. I assume it's another sleeping issue. <laughs> if you not slept this night or something. I know you do that every now and then. Okay, let's see if we can get Lumos skip. I believe. Where are they? Are oh, there? Yep, thanks for the bit, uh, Red. I mean, the alert doesn't play until 10, so I guess scammed. <laughs> ah, get out of here, Malfoy. But I appreciate the bit. The beam. Cool. Woke up at 4 a.m. after 10 hours of sleep. Yep, that is that is a sleep schedule that is very... Um, <laughs> very interesting, to say the least. Okay. I want to be hairy. So let's see if we can get Luma skip. I I'll go for the easy version straight away because I never got the hard one in my life. So fuck that shit. So first we got to fight those instrument guys. Wait, what are you running uh, later, Yoshi? And good luck with it. There we go. Ah, bam. Thanks for the 10 bits as well, Rev. Jesus Christ, 10 more bits. You've, you've cheered like way too many bits, man. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. What do I think? I HP4 again? HP4 or HP5 probably is my guess. Okay, let's see if we can get it. Yeah, imagine Scabbers would have just gotten eaten by Crookshank. That would have been like next level. Okay, pausing here. This should be fine. Yo, Don. Thank you so much for the good luck. Yeah, I rarely do 6th gen, but this week is kind of like the 6th gen week. Oh, I have to watch this, right? I'm an idiot. <laughs> I have to watch this first and then I can go back, right? Wait, is that how it works? Yeah, that's how it works. Is that how it works? I'm a bit confused now. Have I messed it up? Yep, okay, cool. <laughs> then it's fine. I was like a bit confused if you ever have to watch that cutscene. Okay, so I went through this door for no reason. That's fine. Okay, so that's the first one. Let's see if we can get the second pause. Thanks, Lo. Good to know. How's it going, Don? Good to see you around. That's probably bad. That's too late, right? Yeah. Yeah, you can you can tell if the ghoul despawns, I think, then it worked. This is, like, saving a lot of time, so we can give it a couple of attempts, though. You just... The second pause is, like, fairly precise, though, which is the issue. The first one is easy. The first one is just, like, at any point here. And then the second one, you gotta be fairly precise. All right, have a good one, Gorgo. Enjoy. You're gonna get the um, gonna get the crests as well. Oh boy, uh, the the badges rather. The badges are way worse than the crests, but good luck, have fun. Nope, that's not making it. It's 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 just kind of hard to time. Maybe I'm just really bad at it, but the second timing is pretty hard in my opinion. Yeah. Behind on work, I feel you on that. I'm behind on work as well. <laughs> And I'm streaming again for like a lot, way too long, but we'll we'll get there, I believe. I'm sure I can nah, spamming doesn't really work, sadly. Like you can't really frame advance in this game. Is the issue? Oh, that's too late again. Fuck's sake, man! It's so hard to time this. Wait, is this too late? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not. It's not good. Don't leave me behind. Don't leave me behind. It's okay though. Like we can literally waste like three minutes here, and it's probably still saving time. So it's okay. We can we can give this a couple more attempts. Like Luma skip is pretty OP, actually. Let me see if I can find anything. Okay, come on. Yeah, that's good, right? Or was that too early now? Oh, that was too early now. Are you kidding me? Fuck's sake! Yeah, you gotta do it like. After this frame, but before the ones we got before. Like, that's essentially when you have to pause. It's really dumb. You have to see the back of Harry's head. Okay, so the door does not work. Okay, I, I see, I see. Makes sense. The back of Harry's head. That's that's a great description. Let me see if I can find <sighs> Come on, Harry. That's too late again. Dude, literally, I can't get this. <laughs> I can't time this. Yep, that's not... That didn't work. Ah. Uh. Fuck. 
I mean, grammar is important, that is true. Those are just like past tenses though, right? So... Essentially, if you talk about something that happened in the past, then you use those. Sure I can find something. No. See, that's what happens when you spam, like it doesn't advance, so... Maybe, this one maybe? That one was quite quick. No, the ghoul is still there. Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> Please just work. I got it in full series somehow. Is it like frame... It's not frame perfect, surely, right? It can't be that precise. <sighs> this is actually a really annoying trick, but we'll get there. Too late again. Like, literally, how do you time that? <laughs> I feel like the black screen on the door is also like a different length every fucking time. Ah, oh, come on. I should have just not gone for this, honestly. I should have just done the normal way. Now I'm kind of now I'm kind of committed. Now we have to do it, right? Like, otherwise it's just too much time lost. Yeah, but if I press pause early, I get the freaking door. <laughs> That's good though, right? Like that was a good pause. There's no way that didn't work. Wait, that didn't work? How? Wh how was that late? Dude, okay, this is bullshit actually. Like this trick actually sucks. <laughs> Don't leave me behind. Like, I'm pretty sure that was visually the first frame I saw at least, but I guess I can't see fast enough. Apparently not. I thought it would be fine as well, but I guess not. Uh, well, I think there goes the PB. Now, maybe? That's very early. And don't leave me behind. Yeah, I guess we will, Neville. Okay, this one worked. I feel like that was exactly the same like last time, but okay, whatever. Yeah, I think that didn't really save time. <laughs> it's just hard to time. I guess it doesn't really matter how tired you are in this. It's just literally sometimes you get it randomly. Uh, oh, Harry teabagging. Nice, let's go. In the cutscene. Yeah, it's a ghoul, exactly. I mean, I would like to just kill him, but sadly, uh, we can't. We don't have Lumos yet. Now we do. Because even though we skipped the safe book or the the spell book. Fuck off, Ron. Leave me alone. I like how... This is so weird how this glitch is. <laughs> yeah, that is the plan, uh, right? I'm gonna hand out, like, a info doc soon as well. Probably today or tomorrow. Yep, that is the plan indeed. I just kind of hope that it's not like 5 and 6 on the same day, but even if, that still works. Like, that would still work. I'm really looking forward to that. I'm actually curious who's gonna win that stuff. It's gonna be interesting. This fight takes a while. Yeah, no, Harry is not meant to be here normally. Hey, Ron actually killed it. Let's go, Ron. Way to go. Yeah, this fight is supposed to be Ron only, but since we did the glitch... That it took me like five minutes to execute. Um, we have Ron in there. Yeah, imagine 5, 6, 7.1 and 7.2 the first day. All the long ones. That would be fun. Alright, Ron. Pock you. Pock you for killing the thing. Wait, we don't have Lumos. Is that normal? Am I not supposed to have Lumos? Wait, what? Wait, what do I do now? Have I messed up? Oh, save and quit. That's what I forgot. Thank you. Yep, that's what I forgot. I forgot how this trick works. <laughs> I've done it like once in my life, so uh, I guess not a surprise. That's kind of interesting how that gives us Lumos back. That's pretty cool, actually. Oh yeah, Malfoy, obviously. Malfoy did the final hit on the robot. Let's go. Shoutouts to Malfoy. <laughs> Imposter Ron. Yeah, already losing time. I'm not surprised. Like, overall, this was obviously slower. Not surprising at all, but... It's fine. At least it was some practice. Yeah, I thought I had to read. I thought I messed something up. I mean, I guess I did technically. I didn't do the save and quit, which pretty much is messing something up. No, my god, really? Dude, are you kidding me? How did that not give the thing? <laughs> yeah, I guess that is probably what the game's thinking. I wish, I wish HP2 would think the same way. 
Hey, we're in the forest and we should have all the spells. Let's give the player all the spells. Sadly, that's it, it doesn't do it like that. Yeah, there goes all the time that the good glacier skip gave, uh, gave us. We'll see if we still have a chance, but this was pretty rough. You can see how much time we're losing to just doing it normal, but it's still a cool strat. The game won't give you the spells you've missed sometimes, really? Interesting. I mean, you're not supposed to be able to miss spells, right? If you are not... Like, it gives us Carpe, for example. Like, which one does it not give us, actually? I'm curious. Oh, you got your third shot? You did you get it today? Yeah. Yeah, those are kicking in, that's for sure. Get well soon. Quick recovery, hopefully. Oh, that's not the exit. Whoops. Is, is Luma skip a thing in Hundo, by the way? Is there any collectible? I don't think there is, if I recall correct, right? Yep, he didn't learn the spell. He will die in the forest. That's HP2 PC. And I wish it wouldn't be like that, because that would make the run like 10 minutes. Hmm. I see. You can skip Lumos. Okay, cool. So I guess this is good practice for Hundo. I'll take it. Oh, yeah, you said you're gonna feel like shit. Ah, well, I mean, I'm gonna stream on Friday. I'm probably gonna stream for a long time on Saturday as well, so... I guess at least you have something to watch during the recovery. Ah, man, that was really bad. You watched Terminator since ages? Like, the, the first one? Dang. Yeah, it's been a while for me as well since I've watched that. The OG one. I've heard the, the prequel that they've made recently was pretty dang bad, wasn't it? <laughs> and a realistic. It's a good game. It's a fun speedrun as well. I'm just not great at it, but maybe this can still PB. I have no idea. We'll see. I'll try. That serious black. Is that where I split or do I have to end the day? Still have to watch the last movie? Yeah, okay. I, I've heard a lot of not great things about it, to be fair. So yeah, maybe it's better than people make it out to be. Now, I know you're all still very worked up about what's happened, but my advice would be for you all to go. Serious blob. There are all kind of blobs in this game. Okay, there is a dead end day. Wait, what? There you go. So I do split here. Dang, 317 lost to trying Luma skip. Didn't feel like I've tried it for that long, actually, but dang. Because it's supposed to save, like, three minutes, so I must have tried it for, like, six minutes, apparently. That seems weird, but I guess so. Of course, everyone's attention turns to Hagrid. Best character. It's not, is it, so it's not three minutes? I mean, three minutes is still quite a bit. It, I, it didn't feel like it took me six minutes to do the skip, <laughs> but I guess so. Dungeon in the dungeons. Yep, I, I think those are SLS splits. I'm not entirely sure why it's dungeons in the dungeon, but I, I, I like that. It's a good split name. Uh, also, I should probably be hairy for this, huh? Because Hermione is slow AF. Still a weird choice, in my opinion, that they gave them different movement speeds, but oh well. I guess they also- oh my god, why do you stand here? What is your issue? Why would you go there and just like do nothing? Oh my god, I am actually annoyed. What is your issue? Like, why would you do that? Literally stop walking once you're in the middle of the freaking door. Oh my god, I went the wrong way now as well. Oh, fuck's sake. That is dumb. See, that stuff annoys me, because that is just stupid game design. Like, why would you make her movement like that? It's just fucking useless. Yeah, I mean, it's still good, though. Luma step is, skip is still cool, and if you fail it for more than three minutes, I guess so be it, right? But there is a good chance that you get it quite, quite quick. Was that a Ravenclaw? God damn it, Ravenclaw. They know that Harry is like, oh, they want Harry to be late so he loses house points, I think. So they win the house cup. It's all a very smart strat. It's very thought out. That was really annoying, by the way. That was really dumb. <laughs> kind of the HP5 PC feeling. I guess happens. Hermione, I'm sorry to say it, but all 
that studying you're doing can't be healthy. <laughs> if you're not careful, your brain's going to... Wow, Ron. Insulting Hermione studying. I don't think I've ever, ever heard him say that, but okay. That's a bit mean. Mm, yeah, this is just scared magical creatures. I actually had to think like where that is for a second, but it's just Hagrid's hut, of course. At least, at least the grounds look nice in this game. The entire outside castle is actually pretty sick in this game. There's just nothing to do in it. Literally like two chests for Hondo. Everything else is just empty. But it's still a cool outside castle. Still looks quite awesome. Also, I'm probably gonna lose time here now. Because, again, went the wrong way because of the trolling students. Wait, why is Hagrid walking around here? Are You, you, have, you have a class to teach, Hagrid. Stop walking. <laughs> You did it, Pock you. I assume setting up OBS for connect, I assume. Oh, I mean, I honestly don't even know how I would set that up. That's gonna be really weird with the webcam. He's a hypocrite. Is there proud? You always wait for a hippogriff to make the first move. It's polite, see? You walk towards him and you bow and you wait. If he bows back, you're allowed to touch him. All right, Hagrid. Sounds Ron, simple enough. Hermione, who wants to go first? I love how he only addresses like three people from his entire class. <laughs> the others don't even have a chance to be first. Favoritism at its best. Good job, Hagrid. Fuck off, Buckbeak. I'm, I wasn't even that fast. Fuck off. <laughs> Stupid hypocrite. Right then, climb up there, just behind the wing joint. Oh well, this is not a good uh, uh, care of magical well creatures. Done. Like this is gonna lose quite a bit some time of, of time, but it's okay. Right, catch as many as you. Yeah, it's pretty much the same crystal. I think there's like only a very slight difference. It's like it looks a bit different, I think, and uh, I know for HP two there is like prefects on the grounds that. In, in PlayStation that Xbox doesn't have, like at night, for example. Like, there's some minor differences, but it's overall pretty much the same game. Yep. That was a welcome in. Oh, that was a lot of bets. That was good. I'll take this. I'll take this. Thank you very much. I, how is there not enough room to dismount? The, the, what are you on about, game? Oh my god, what the fuck? There is literally a fucking plane here. Why is there not enough room to dismount? What do you mean? There's fucking infinite room here. <laughs> what the fuck is that shit? This game's dumb. Honestly. Like, it's fun to play, but it's also, like, really dumb. I have to be close to Hagrid. Why don't they say that, then? Why do they say there isn't enough room to dismount? That's, like, literally not what the issue is. <laughs> fuck off, game. It's a bit easy. Yeah, go for it, Malfoy. You're totally not gonna get wrecked. Why does he even have his wand out? Kappa Pry. Oh, look how Hagrid caught him. That's actually kind of sick. Hagrid, the, the, you know, last second hero. That was a nice catch. Is that where he split? No, I don't think it is. I'm, I, surely I'm losing time here. There's no way I'm saving. Harry made his way to the Quidditch match, unaware that events that day would take an even worse they put one text box for it that is so lazy like what the fuck the it's so misleading as well <laughs> like if they say if they tell me there isn't enough space to dismount then i'm like yeah well wh what else should i do but if they tell me hey please get closer to hagrid then i know what to do so that would actually be helpful but yeah guess not with this game at least we have epic slow motion dementor i mean this cutscene is like a lot better than on pc i gotta give him that yeah, still no Quidditch. I assume they were actually just not allowed to build in Quidditch. I'm like actually fairly certain because Quidditch World Cup. Do I? I think I missed the split actually. Maybe not. Not entirely sure. Harry slept restlessly. Yeah, I guess that's true. It's not the not the first time not the first time that EA devs are lazy, or maybe not lazy, but probably on too much of a clock and didn't have time. That's more likely even I think. Harry having severe nightmares. The poor guy. Ron? Quiet. I know 
Dude, Ron knows where Sirius Black is. That's kind of cool. Let's follow him. Follow me. <laughs> follow me. Uh, do we even want to chase him yet, by the way? Do we even know about the entire thing that he's our godfather and, like, sold out Harry's parents? Is that even... Has that ever even been a thing? Like, why are we chasing Sirius Black, <laughs> actually? Like, thinking about it. Yeah, he's not talking about beans enough. Malfoy's disguise was very good, but he, he forgot to talk about beans. That's Otherwise, all of us would have fully believed it. To a secret bean start. Yeah, if he would have just said that, like, hey, Harry, I want, you to, show, I want to show you my bean stash. Can you follow me? I would have 100% believed him. Also, Harry's pajamas are actually kind of sick, let's be honest. The white and red, pretty, pretty, pretty nice. Yeah, yeah, right, like, why would we chase Sirius Black? Exactly, he's a pretty, pretty dangerous criminal, and we literally have no reason to. Hey, yo, Kisser Darren. Weasley, Weasley. Because I'm pretty sure they had no cutscene where they explained that. Oh, maybe that's how they meant it, yeah. Maybe Ron is like, no, I don't think, I'm pretty sure later on Ron says something like, oh, Sirius Black is around this corner, so it's not like that, Cosmic. It's not like Ron leading Harry away from Sirius Black so he doesn't kill him. No, I'm pretty sure they, they mean to chase him, or at least Ron does. Which I guess makes sense, because Malfoy, as far as I know, knows about the entire thing, actually, in the books as well. About the entire Sirius Black ratting out the Potters thing. I mean, Harry is trying to stop Ron, but like, still, like, why would Ron be chasing after Sirius Black? It kind of makes no sense. But oh well. I have to follow. Ah, uh, oops. Yeah, I like that theory as well. Still, that Ron already knows that Malfoy's up to no good, and he sent Peeves to uh, delay him. Peeves being the actual good guy of the story. <laughs> We can get Sirius Black on our own. Yeah, he does say that, but like, why would they want to in the first place? That's 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 the thing I'm not understanding. Because they didn't give us that plot exposition of Sirius Black being his godfather and like betraying his parents. I mean, it's pretty cool if you can transform into a dog, to be fair. That's definitely a nice perk. Maybe that's what is what Malfoy is after, after all. Also, this level is really dumb. It's like actually kind of boring. After that, we have the um, after that we have the shortcut though, right? Where we save and quit to skip the cutscene or to skip some walking. Is that after this? I think it is after this. No, that's later, isn't it? Fuck! Now I'm confused. We'll see. Uh, no, I think after this we just end the day or something. I don't know. And hey, you're in 27 month. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Welcome in today. Thank you so much for 27 months. I feel like you've resubbed recently, but I guess maybe it's just maybe a month just flies past so fast. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. That's a long time. And uh, yeah, enjoy the emotes for another month. Okay, good. I don't like those knights, but that was decent. Yeah, no, that's a good point, Cosmic. The, on the other hand, Harry and Ron are not the. The brightest candles. <laughs> you can't say that, right? How, how do you say it? They're not the the sharpest tool in the shed. They're not all stars. Polyjuice potion. I think we polyjuice potion. Perhaps I might mention. Yeah, let's chase this feckin' murderer that killed like thirteen people with one spell. What could go wrong? Hell yeah. Yeah, who would have thought it was Malfoy all along? I, what a plot twist. I'm shocked. I'm absolutely shocked. Oh, Peeves told Ron. Ooh. Okay, that's kind of cool. Actually, the game actually says that. So Peeves is the good guy. Yeah, what a twist. Oh, who would have thought? <laughs> they do that often, though, in the games. The Polyjuice Potion. I mean, I think... They, how, did, how have they done that in the movies, actually? I don't even remember. But in the in the games they do that a lot, that the clothes just change color. The polyjuice potion is mighty. <laughs> Whoa. 
Okay, I kind of want to be Harry for this. Pajama Harry. Yep. Uh, the best enemy. God, they look ugly from up front. Holy shit. Or up close. Like, holy shit. Was there one guy on the railing up there? What the heck? How did he get up there? Is that normal? That was pretty solid though. Usually you get stopped by them more than that once. I'll take it. The red caps. Yep, 2GBA is still the laziest polyjuice potion of all time. Like, absolutely. Good. Curious what Welfare wanted to say that he saw a serious black dragon Harry into the night. When you do the opposite at the end of the game. Oh yeah, that is quite ironic, true. Harry is dragging... Harry is dragging serious black into the night. Kind of romantic, really. Yeah, I, I know in the book she stole some clothes in HP2. I don't know how it was in the movie. That's a good question. Mm, I think that's the theory, at least. And yo, Dustrix, welcome in. Because, you know, Malfoy is actually, like, pretty good at stuff, right? Like, he's pretty good at Quidditch, and he's pretty good at magic and all, but Harry is just Harry, so everyone's kind of looking up to Harry, and nobody cares too much about Malfoy, so I think that's where the jealousy kicks in. But also probably the fact that Malfoy got rejected in year one when he uh, when he tried to be friends with Harry and Harry just completely rejected him. Hermione. Harry's model and HP1 restored. What on earth did you and do HP1 you restored? He does it. He has a different model than there's just the HP1 PC one. I don't remember. Is that a thing? Could be the inspiration if that's the thing. In the beginning. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah, probably then. Yeah, that's a good point. I've never thought about that. Must be. Or, no, I, do I doubt they have that in the HP1 game file. Oh, come on, Harry. I pressed A. Oh, well. Dude, I pre I'm pressing A. What the fuck? They're not grabbing this. Okay, whatever. It worked, I guess. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's, in, in this game he doesn't need to bribe people to get Gryffindor clothes, to be fair. Because the Polyjuice Potion just transforms you completely. It's actually kind of surprising that in the books he never used, well, he did use it in HP, HP 6, I guess. But he never used it to get back on Harry, specifically. Wait, what? I literally pressed different buttons and they brought me into the game. What? How is that possible? I pressed the correct button and it brought, brought me into the same wrong menu. What the fuck? <laughs> I swear I pressed select and it gave me the main menu and I was like, wait, what? And then I pressed start and it gave me the main menu. And then I pressed start again and it, well, obviously gave me the main menu, but that was weird. That is some unnecessary time loss. Also, I really don't want to die here if possible. Thank you. Once a rat, forever a rat. Yeah, his, his animagus is very ironic. It's a very fitting one. Definitely. Hey, you can to welcome in. They're all pretty fitting, right? Like James being the the stack, kind of the super protective animal with the big horns. Makes sense as well, you know. I think they've chosen quite some nice uh, animaguses. Dude, turn around, Hermione. The controls in this game sometimes are actually just the worst. <laughs> But we'll get there. That was not a good segment so far. Oh yeah, the, the loyal friend. Yeah, that's also perfect. I never thought about that. I was actually, like, I couldn't really find anything for serious, but yeah. But yeah, the stack actually makes perfect sense. Like, it's a, it's a, you know, probably a bit of a, of an animal that takes itself too serious, so to speak. I mean, stacks are... Fairly. I mean, they have the big uh, horns and everything, and I, I, I don't know. When I think of a stack, I feel like, hey, that's the thing I do not want to mess with, you know? <laughs> I don't know if they're super protective, but that comes to mind. Oops. That's actually a good idea, to be fair. I never really cool down the flames, but that is a good idea. We have enough health, though. We should be fine. But that is a smart idea, because Flipendo we really do not need at all. What would Harry's Animagus be? Probably an owl. <laughs> He's way too attached to Hedwig. To be fair though, or a phoenix, yeah, that could be cool as well as the ultimate Gryffindor. 
To be fair though, like being a bird as a Patrono uh, Animagus is like just the smartest thing. Like how cool is that? Why would you want to be anything else if you could just be a bird? How old is this game? Uh, 2004, I think. Hey yo, Jaso, welcome in chat. Yeah, 2004 for the original Xbox. Uh, we need Ron actually. Yeah, nice one. <laughs> I know, right, Ron? I changed your spell to Lumos. I feel really, really powerful right now. Thank you for the compliment. Dude, what? You can... Yeah, what happens if you become... Dude, Harry, why? Literally, why? You had you had no reason to do that, Harry. That was so fucking stupid. He did one spell on to us and nothing after anymore. And now he's freaking teabagging. Fuck off, Harry. I hate you. Like, actually, what is wrong with you? That was the ultimate, like, troll from Harry. Literally what you would expect in a Harry Potter online lobby. Yeah, this game is older than quite a few people on, on the planet right now. It's, it's really crazy. I mean, this game is, like, only five, six years younger than me. So it's kind of crazy. It's really, really weird to think about. Oh yeah, they are Hinky Punks. I'm surprised you know the name actually. I'm I'm impressed. Because I always forget Hinky Punk. It's such a dumb name. But yeah, what happens to someone who becomes a uh, a marine animal as a as a as an animagus? Are they just gonna suffocate instantly? Because they, you know. If they're you know not not in the water, that's kinda bad for fish. Good question. Never never thought about that. That see it seems pretty useless to be fair, having a uh, having a water animagus. Uh, two thousand and four was still pretty big for Xbox, right? I don't know when the three hundred and sixty came out. That must have been like two seven or so. I don't know actually. Maybe no, maybe earlier than that, right? But pretty sure two thousand and four people still played with it. I mean, to be fair, the original Xbox was never that popular, right? Compared to the PlayStation. PlayStation 2, rather. Yeah, that's a good question. We, n we don't know of anyone who changed into a magical animal. That's a good point. Like, I don't know if you could become a unicorn. I guess, why not, right? Don't see anything being against that, but we just don't have any example of that in the story. I'm not sure how that saved two minutes, but okay. Was not a good dungeon. It was pretty, pretty dang Papega. But could have been worse. I don't know what this pace is. I don't know if we can still PB this by any chance. We'll find out. Ooh, that's actually a good point, Dor. That's a, that's a nice uh, plot hole. J.K. Rowling didn't think about that. Maybe the lake just has a direct connection to, I don't know, the sea or whatever. Oh, imagine a dragon. Dragon as an Animagus. That would be super awesome. Or a Thestral would be pretty sick. <laughs> yeah, I, I, it's probably... They probably don't allow magical animals. Or a truckle. I would probably be a truckle. That sounds like right up my alley. <laughs> We go to potions, I assume, right? No, we get the ingredients first. Shit, I hate those as parts of the run. We have to get the ingredients. Don't you dare stopping now, thank you. Another Ravenclaw troll. Unsuccessful this time. Yeah, it's another question. Would you keep the abilities? That's another point. I'm not sure about that either. I mean, if you transform into a normal animal, they kind of do keep their abilities. Like, Rita Skeeter can still fly around as a bird and everything, so... I guess you probably would keep the magical ones as well. So every time you're about to die as a wizard, you transform into a phoenix and you just don't die. <laughs> that would be a bit OP, I agree. I do hope they find Sirius Black soon. <laughs> just He's don't die really for scary. it. Exactly. 
A corn that studies is a unicorn, I see. That's that's a clever pun. <laughs> yeah, that that's a good question as well, actually. Yeah, that is a good question, actually. What happens if you like take the if you transform into an animal and you like shave all the hair off? Is does that mean the wizard have it has its has has their head shaved as well or what? Like how does that work? Wizards go against the laws of physics. I'm not okay with that. They just generate matter out of nowhere. Even if we find some cheap purple, how are we going to get the carapaces off them? Leave that to me, Ron. I have a plan. And that plan includes you drowning in the lake at the end, but don't be too afraid, it's fine. Just ruin that cloth doing that? Oh maybe something like that, yeah. <laughs> could that could be the outcome. Or it just doesn't do anything, who knows. But that would be weird, because that would literally be like creating mad matter out of nowhere. If you could get like the unicorn wa uh, hair and nothing happens to the wizard. Alright, Buckbeak. Let's get on a ride. Or well, let's go on a ride. Get some billy wigs. The worst thing in this game. No, the worst thing are the, the, the doxy eggs, actually. Billy wigs are a close second, though. I mean, it's cool that they have this flying in the open world. I have to admit. PC doesn't. They just have it in those weird, like, parkour stuff. But See, that's why I hate them. I flew right into it and I didn't collect it. Oh, man. Please. Please stop moving. I'm not that fast on my freaking buckbeak. Okay, there you go. Not too bad, I guess. That worked. Peter's clothes that were the same color as Scabbard's fur. Oh, I actually never paid attention to that. That is some nice attention to detail, actually. Yeah, I hope so too. I hope Hogwarts Legacy makes it possible to be in Animagus. I thought my game would crash for a second because of that lag. I hope so too. I, I, I expect a lot from Hogwarts Legacy, to be honest. And I, I didn't want that. I, I kind of wanted to... You know, expect nothing so I don't get disappointed, but it's really hard to do that. It's really, really hard to expect nothing from the game. Or, and to not get hyped. Um, hello? Okay, I guess that didn't work for some reason. Can you? Thank you. There we go, Armani. We'll have enough. Now we have to go back. Yeah, that would probably be like a late game quest, if anything. Like, that would probably be uh, t take a while until you get there, but yeah. You, <laughs> that's the one thing you want really bad. The one thing I want really bad for the game is um, a really nice open world castle. Yeah, <laughs> probably something like that door. We'll see. I mean, it's not really supposed to be online though, so I guess those lobbies probably don't exist. Because all we know for now is that it has an offline mode, but we don't really know if it's ever gonna have an online co-op mode even. But yeah, <laughs> I have I have a mental picture in my head now as well. Can I get this? Okay. The worst thing is to expect nothing and still get disappointed. <laughs> yeah, let's hope it's not gonna be like that, you know? Let's hope let's hope they're not gonna have a game and where like if even if you don't expect anything, it's still bad. I hope it's at least like solid, honestly, the entire legacy thing. Oops. Stop stop teabagging, Harry, honestly, please. Stop teabagging. <laughs> I don't like your BM. I know I'm slow at this game. Leave me alone. Wait, this guy is still alive? How? Can you eat him, please? Thank you. Thought I soft lock for a second because I know you can soft lock here. Okay, remember when I mentioned that this route ends with you drowning in a lake, Ron? Well, sorry. Gotta do it. <laughs> Poor Ron. Yeah, I hope so. Again, hopefully in like, what was it, two days or something? They give us more info? We'll see. I hope the story is multi-year as well. I hope it's gonna be a long story. Dude, I don't know. It's just... 
I feel like the expectations are too high, though. Like, there's no way they can fulfill that in one game, but we'll see. Was it tomorrow when they have the, the conference thingy? The press conference? Yeah, hopefully. I'll, uh, I'll be streaming, so I know, I hope people keep me updated. I don't really expect anything either. Sony event, yeah. Yeah, I mean, Sony is only connected to it, like, very, very, like, just a little bit. Because it's on a console that they have, but... It's not super connected to Hogwarts Legacy, to be fair. So, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe we get lucky, get some info. I don't really expect anything, though. Mm, they didn't for the Star Wars game door for uh, Fallen Order. That was EA, right? I'm pretty... Oh, wait. Also, this isn't EA, by the way. This is... Um, just Warner Brothers publishing and uh, I forgot the studio that makes it but EA is actually like 0% involved which is good I think honestly yeah first time we heard about it was a Sony event true true I, I really do hope they have at least like a trailer or something or like a gameplay reveal or whatever fairy wings <laughs> why was Harry so happy when he said fairy wings I feel like Harry wants to kill fairies. I'm, I'm a bit, I'm a bit worried about this guy. The ad exclusive exclusivity for Hogwarts Legacy. I guess that would make sense. Yeah, they might have that. That's a good point. We'll see. We'll see. I really do hope they give us something soon. I can't wait for that game to come out so I can stream it. Legitimately. Can I end day? Oh, I cannot end day. Okay, I guess we have to go all the way up. Snape looks like he gained, I don't know, 30 kilograms during the uh, summer break. <laughs> I guess kind of like a baby. Yeah, babies are kind of chubby. That's pretty much how he is as well. I don't know what he's done during the summer break. I guess he's been eating quite a bit, but man. I really need to turn tune it down a bit, Snape. Wait, where do we even have to go? Second floor, okay. I guess I just didn't split correctly then. Do we safety safe though? That's the question. Yeah, Harry is such a good friend. Avalanche, thank you. That's the um, that's the programmer. That's the the, stu the studio that makes the game exactly. Yeah, Harry is such a good friend. Exactly. I mean, at least he tried to stop Ron from chasing Sirius Black, but that was only kind of like. I don't feel like he's done it wholeheartedly. Like it was just a half-assed attempt at stopping Ron to chasing Sirius Black. Maybe he kind of wanted Ron to die. <laughs> Finally getting rid of the guy. Okay, I'm gonna save. I'm too scared to miss it. Like, it's not a hard trick, but... It's not like saving takes a lot in this game. Like, a long time. <laughs> yeah. After the Weasleys pranked him... Oh, that's a fly. I was like, what the fuck is walking on my wall? But it's just a fly. But after the Weasleys pranked him in HP1 PC with all the beans, he, he just ate them all. That's how he became HP3 Snape. <laughs> okay, let's see. So there is a skip to skip the entirety of the challenge, which we'll hopefully get. Sorry. <laughs> Close up Goyle. Perfect. Would you be so kind as to bring Harry and Ron to the front with you? It's your turn to retrieve the Carpe Retractum spellbook. Kill the fly, but it's not doing anything. It's just on the wall. It's just chilling. Okay, we gotta spam start. I spammed the wrong button. Oh my god. <laughs> See, good thing we saved. Uh, that's not what you want. I spammed select and not start. Well, that sucks. That's It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. This challenge really does suck, so it's really nice that you can fully skip it. I made a mistake. See, good thing we safety save. I told you we would probably need that, so... Quite, ha quite happy that I've done that. It's still slow, obviously, now, but... At least we can get a second chance. I literally spammed the wrong button because I don't know where the freaking start button is on this controller. Why are we so slow? Mistakes were made. Means we have to rewatch the cutscene, which... I mean, I guess there's worse. Don't know why Harry is so slow. That was weird. 
It's not a long cutscene. And we have the Goyo close up again, so that's cool. It allows you to seize and pull objects within your the memory leak. I mean, it should be fine after re uh, saving and reloading, though, right? Sorry. Sorry. Miss Granger. Would you be if so not, I can always restart my console as well. It's not like that takes too long. It's your turn to retrieve the Carpe Retractum spellbook. Depends on loading zones. Interesting. Not sure what that means, really, but yep. There you go. It's really easy. You literally just spam the correct button and you get it. It's like so fucking free. Some reset it, but I'm not sure which ones. Okay, I'll just continue a bit and we'll see what happens. We still have to load into the level and then we have to save and quit. Wait, actually? Yeah. Start new game and quit. But you have to watch the entire cutscene then, right? That's kind of bad. And I guess I have to do that then. Am I even allowed to do that? <laughs> I guess why not? Guess there's nothing really against it. Yeah, I have to watch this entire cutscene then. <laughs> well, okay, cool. I guess that's a good way to fix it then. That's If that works, that's nice. Otherwise, we keep slow Harry for the entire run, I guess. <laughs> Kill the spare. Hey, the fly is gonna be nice. It's gonna, gonna be good for the uh, ecosystem somehow. I don't actually know what flies do. I guess they eat like carcasses or some shit. I don't know. Azio Hasma, welcome in. Yeah, this is actually kind of a long cutscene, but okay. If this fixes the memory leak, then I'm all for it. Yeah, I, I feel like actually restarting the console is probably fun. I, I guess it's probably about the same. Okay, now we can load back into the save we had. And hopefully we don't have slow Harry anymore. I guess we'll find out. This is still going to save a lot of time over this old PB, by the way. Because Carper, like, skipping the entire challenge is quite OP. Turns out it's quite a long challenge. Like, half an hour long or something. How's your Damon? Thanks for the good luck. Good to see you around. Hope you had a good day. Now we just end the day, right? Yep. There we go. Yep, not quite. Carbo retractum check. 24 minutes. Should have been more like 30, but I messed up a bit. Ah, uh, this is gonna be close. Like, this is gonna be hard to PB. We will get a lot of time save here in this split, but apart from that, I don't know, man. I don't know if this has a chance to PB. That is interesting, yeah. It's good to know. Good, good that you knew how to fix the memory leak, to be fair. I mean, I guess I would have just restarted my console, which would have probably also worked. Yeah, it was very easy clap. Um, well, apparently not that easy for me because I almost messed it up. <laughs> but that's okay. I'm, I'm going to safety save again for the next big skip in, like, uh, Hogsmeade. But first, we have Expecto Patronum. Oh, I do not have my my info thing open actually. And yo, Volky, welcome in. Yep, it's it's a new trick though. Like I never do any percent runs of this, so um, I have like really old splits. And I think they're even glitchless, but I might be wrong. Um, fuck, I need my I need my help. I need to know what to do in the freaking Patronum room. So yeah, that's essentially why. How's it going though, Volky? Welcome in. Saving time is the best trick. It's the trick I would recommend to everyone. Saving time is, is good for speedruns, it turns out. I'm doing really well, actually. Thanks for asking. Really can't complain. Also, internet has not been that bad today. It's been it's it's been stabilized, so that's cool. Um, it's a bit hot. Yeah, it's getting warmer here as well. It's, it's quite nice though. I actually enjoy it quite a bit. It's like the second summer kind of kicking in. <laughs> um, yeah, I agree by the way, H Hasma. The pajama part is kind of comfy. I did, but I'm still stuck with my current one for a couple weeks with the Vodafone. Until it's like finally completely switched. 
The intro cutscene isn't that long compared to rebooting. I don't know, it's fine, it's whatever, we got there in the end, it's fixed now, we're fast Harry again, so whatever. If anything, it might be free time save for the next run. Hey Pika, welcome in. Samurai Warriors 5, nice, enjoy. Don't, have never played that game, but probably quite fun. Ah, Harry, I see you brought your friends. The spell oh, the intro cutscene was actually longer than normally. <laughs> That's great as well. Kind of guard I don't know how that happens, the memory leak stuff. Like, I didn't even do anything that you wouldn't really do as a normal player. Like, I literally just save and quit and reload it. Like, it's not like that's really anything breaking the game or whatnot. I guess it's just EA coding. They are not particularly great at that. Turns out. Also, this challenge sucks. It's really not fun. Probably my least favorite challenge. After Carpe, but Carpe, since we can skip it fully, it doesn't matter anymore. But yeah, this one sucks. Hey, I, I don't know why he brought his friends. They actually don't have any... Actually, they do have a use later on. Because Hermione learns Draconi Force. That's why we bring them. But it's just kind of, it's just kind of weird. I agree. It's not what I remember from the books. I mean, also, that's a good point, yeah. I just need to play a game and everything breaks. I don't even have to try. That's a very good point. Can't wait for Hogwarts Legacy, you know. Maybe we can find some exclusive glitches and then, like, get our name into the game or something for finding something dumb. It's actually going to be really interesting to see speedrun-wise. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Because we don't really have any Harry Potter games that are constantly updated, right? So that's gonna be, once that's out, that's probably gonna be the first game that constantly will get, like, bug fixes and updates and stuff, so... I don't know. It's gonna be interesting how we're gonna handle that, I guess. Okay. This room is hell. I do have the route through this room open, though, because I cannot bother remembering it. Like, this room really sucks if you don't know where to go, because it's kind of like a puzzle, like a maze. Um, forward, left, forward, forward, left. Okay. I think it's probably gonna be like, we'll have the different versions as different leaderboards or different vari variables, essentially. Forward, left, forward, forward, left. Yeah, I agree about that. Carpe PC is really fun, especially with the speed strats. Thanks, Hans. That actually helps. And on console, Carpa is just really dumb. Same as Patronum, yeah, this can actually go into the trash can indeed. Yeah, well, if you don't count the mobile games, then yeah, which is kind of crazy. Since I'm speedrunning HP, the first time there's a new HP game. I mean, there's a, it's the first time a new HP game is coming out since I'm like... 15 or something. I don't even know when HP 7.2 came out. Uh, right, right, back, left, back, back. I can do that. Always from the entrance. Oh, fuck off. Mm. I see. So that's what glitched it. That makes sense, I guess. Can't, I guess I can't blame the game for having memory leak then. Um, hello? Hello? I know this is correct. What the fuck? Why are you taking so long? I mean, I did, I did do some weird button combinations. I was mashing, like, quite everything, really. Give me my soul back. I mean, I, I have to say, though, we, we have trash-talked this challenge in Carpe, but the animation when the Dementors attack you are actually really cool. I gotta, I gotta give them that. Like, they're actually quite awesome, this, like, soul-leaving-the-body kind of stuff. Forward, right, back. Park you, Yoshi. Are you streaming it today? I assume so, right? That's pretty cool. Good luck, have fun with that. If I would have almost crashed, I probably would have been faster, actually. <laughs> I don't know. Oops. Can't say I do, Dumbledore, actually. Like, because of the bugs in the game, or what? 
I assume that's why. Uh, forward, forward, left, forward, right. Forward, forward. Park you, Hans. Welcome back on PC. You can do your moderating stuff better. Let's go. Yeah, if we get back to the minigame. I mean, I still like how Expected Patronum looks in this as well. But yeah, it's kind of dumb. The movement is kind of dumb. But I do, I do like the way it looks. Yeah, it's fine. We got out of it. Thanks for helping me out of it, Cosmic. For sure. Um, so it's, it's all good. We got past it. I don't think this PBEs, but we'll see. Yeah, this room, it's, it's boring if you even, if you know where to go, it's like a bad room. If you don't know where to go, it's like a maze. Like, you have to choose the correct path through those, like, pillars and, like, statues. It's, it's absolutely horrendous casually. Like, it really sucks. Um, also, yeah, same here, I feel like. Like, actually, I think I'm gonna try to just enjoy the first speed, uh, playthrough. Not go, like, anything, um, anything speedrun-wise, honestly. Like, I'll try to just, uh, just enjoy it casually. Don't think about speedrunning at all and just play it. The Patronus Spellbook. Yo, Horizon. Welcome in. I'm doing okay. What about yourself? Platinum Trophy playthrough makes sense, yeah. I mean, I'm probably gonna get it for the PC, so... Doubt. Maybe it's gonna be on Steam, but I kind of actually. I mean, yeah, it might actually be on Steam to be fair, because it's Warner Brothers. They don't have to put it on Origin or anything. They might actually put it on Steam. I just thought about it. So maybe it actually does have achievements. Oh, we could have all achievements as a category. Hell yeah! All achievements is a great category. Sadly, never really a thing for Harry Potter. Doesn't really work. <laughs> Wait, enjoying games. Yeah, I know, I know. After watching speedruns for too long, it seems impossible that that's actually, like, a thing, but, yeah. You heard also, I don't know where to split here. Yeah. I think I missed it. <laughs> Why? Could be better. Ah, oh, that Why sucks to hear. Yeah, I hope you can at least enjoy the stream a bit. Hope Very it's much. gonna be better oh. soon. Severus. Gonna request that then? Yeah, definitely. Like, I definitely do one as well, for sure. Hogwarts Legacy is gonna be fun. I'm really looking forward. Try not to be seen. Yeah, that's speedrunning. I'm not doing the casual ones, because of Darren. I had that once, but I didn't enjoy it too much. Mm, some of them. I assume you're talking about Harry Potter games, right, Matthew? Some of them, I agree, are actually pretty good games. And you do forget that quite often when you speedrun. But there's also others which are just, like, not. <laughs> and hey, Donkey, welcome in. Good to see you around. I love how much time they have. Like, Lupin went out to buy time for us, but, like, it's just infinite time. Shoutouts to Lupin. What a guy. Just about speedrunning in general. Yeah, that's also fair, yeah. It's just, if you play a game for too long, I guess, you, you enjoy it in a different way, I guess. You don't enjoy it for the game it is. You just want to go fast. Oh, I thought there's, like, anything popping up. Prompting me to equip this. Ah, uh, hopefully, hopefully 50 minutes. That's the that's the prediction about. Like my PB is a 2:15, so technically we can say 50 minutes. Uh, I had a pretty bad Luma, so the rest of the run was at least okay. So we'll see if we have a chance to beat that loadless. We'll see. I'll try my best. But yeah, quite a bit. Those splits are just weird. I think they're my glitchless splits. Or just really old PBs, but I think glitchless is what they are. Yeah, fair enough. Like, I, I, we, we thought about having HP6 all badges before, but it was kind of like a meh category, really. And the issue is you also need kind of like a lot of crests anyways to get all badges, because you need to unlock Fred and George's potion, right? But that would pretty much be like all trophies, the equivalent, like HP6 all badges or something, right? Or is it just 100%? I'm not sure. Maybe that's just what it is. I don't quite know what they give you a trophy for on on the PlayStation version of HP6. Come on, hurry up. <laughs> right, Maze? And welcome in. Nah, it's just like, the any percent run has the same tricks as Hando, and I don't really need to practice the route, like, I'm gonna have the dock open anyway, so I should be fine, route-wise, but I just need to practice the, the, the skips, really. 
and uh, those are the same on 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 any percent in any percent and in hundo. All golden badges, all crests. Oh, you need all crests, okay. Well, in that case, yeah, in that case, it's literally just uh, HP six hundo <laughs> that you would have to request for all trophies. What? That guy saw me, really? Welcome back, chirp. It's it's okay. I don't know if this is on PB pace. Like, oh, really? It puts you here. What the fuck? Oh, I got stuck on the bookshelf, so you saw me. That sucks. That really sucks. Oh well. So yeah, it should it should be definitely good enough practice for a hundo. Okay, there you go. Uh, I, I my PB happened in the full series, and I never like I never really did any percent runs on those splits. I either did it in like trifectas or single year or full series. <laughs> uh, that's th this floor. Whoops. So I honestly, those splits mean nothing. Absolutely nothing. You don't need all the silver ones. That is really weird. Why would they? Why would they not have a trophy for just all badges? That is really weird, but interesting. Thanks for the good luck, mate. Appreciate it. And enjoy your Valorant. Yeah, the the that's actually that actually works out quite well, I think, for the meme run. It should start roughly in that, so nice time management. Okay, you know what? I'll save once. I messed it up the first time, so just in case we mess it up again. I'm gonna save once. It's an easy trick, but it saves like so much time that I cannot afford to lose it. Like I'd rather reload the game if I fail it than just like, you know. Having to play the level. It's also like a really shit level, which I really don't want to play. That's on top of it. Oh god, I did not see that guy. Help. Okay, we're fine somehow. <laughs> that was really, really bad. I did not see the knight for some reason somehow. Okay, press start. Press the correct button. Hmm. Yeah, that is weird. Maybe they just forgot to give a trophy to that. Got it. Again, it's very easy. You just literally spam start, but hey. Again, better safe than sorry. And then we save kind of in the loading screen. Or in the level transition screen. And now we just have to watch the intro cutscene of the next level. And then we save and quit and we skip the entire level. Because this game is good. It's well made. Okay, we have 45 minutes from now on load list to finish this. Can we do that? There's like the entire ingredients, the entire quidditch, and then the late game. Ooh, this is hard to PB, I think. Yeah, I'll fake PB though, Tavern. Like my actual one is from uh, full series. It's like I never did runs of this really on single splits. Usually I only run this in multi runs. But hey, Tavern, good to see you around. Welcome in. Hope you had a great Wednesday so far. Oh, five star quidditch. Yeah, that's one of the worst because of fake rings. All right, and this should be where you spawn. Is it? I'm an idiot. <laughs> Thanks for the good luck as well. Appreciate it. I, I'm like I'm actually like confused right now if this is correct, but I think it is. I'm pretty. Oh god, don't do that. Don't not again. This guy literally caught. Dude, <laughs> Harry, I I'm pressing the button gently. Why do you sprint off the wall like a madman? What are you doing? Actually, though, Harry, please just calm down. Honestly, let's just take this like safer. Dude, dude can you stop doing that? What the fuck? I'm literally pressing the button once, like, really, really for a short time, so he gets off the wall, but he just, like, freaking yeets into the middle of the room right now. What the fuck? See, that's what I wanted to do all along. The, the, the essentially what I did right now, just gently getting off the wall, but he just had none of it. Wait, actually, I'm so confused. Are we in the correct safe state? I feel like something went wrong. Thanks for the follow, though. Wait, huh? I'm a bit confused where this put us. 
think I debated myself. I think I had just had to leave, right? Did I load the wrong save? I hope not. That would be really bad. Wait. Doesn't it doesn't normally put you here, right? I'm I'm really confused. Did I load the I don't think I did load the wrong save. I think we're fine. I don't know if the save screen should change though. That's what I'm a bit worried about. Uh well, I mean, we don't really have those that much in Harry Potter Curse of Darren, but I generally don't hate it. Seems interesting. Yeah, I am very confused right now. I I'll just I'll just pretend I've gotten it <laughs> and we'll see. I I don't remember where this is supposed to put you, but like I surely I've gotten the trick. If I didn't load the wrong save, which I don't think I did, then it should be fine, right? I just lost a lot of time because I was like really dumb, but that's okay. So there's another trick here. There's a reason we take this like shortcut. Because if you take the shortcut and then save and quit here, which I hope now I'm not fucking over anything, but should be fine. If you save and quit here, um, then you and then reload, then it puts you right at into the cutscene. So you skip like a lot of walking. And I think you might even skip a cutscene. I'm not entirely sure. Let's see where this puts us. Oh god, it, it doesn't help that all of the save states have the same name now. That this does not help at all. The confusion is coming in. Yeah, that's how I feel right now as well, Vogue. You know, it's fine. We work Wait, that put Okay. I guess I just didn't remember where you respawn after Hogsmeade, because this is correct. We are in the cutscene. In this this cutscene. We teleported there, so it's fine. Teleporting around the castle. Again, that's I agree, that's the best part of this run. I just got super confused where it spawned me after the after the fox meet, but that, I guess that must have been the correct spot then. I just lost a lot of time because I got caught like three times, like an idiot. I don't feel like I've ever gotten like I've ever spawned there though, but whatever. We got it. That's all that matters. Still saving like eight minutes. Should have saved way more to this though. Yeah, PB would will be hard at this point. Unfortunately. What a night. I know, right, Ron? Yeah, me too. Oh, really? I have to end the day? Okay, well, I guess that's probably where I split then. No, this actually worked. Okay, we're fine. I don't know. I just got really confused by this. <laughs> when did Harry ever care about rules? Even though it would be in his own best interest to not give Neville the, po the password, let's be honest. Why is Ron hiding under his bed? Security was tight. Is he so scared of Sirius Black? But yeah, it would be in Harry's best interest to not give Neville the password so Sirius Black cannot break into the common room anymore. Oh, looking for sca- oh yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> he was not hiding. Yeah, I don't know, that's a good point. Like, should have really uh, told Sir Cadogan to... Uh, to just not let Sirius Black in. But maybe the, the portrait password or the portraits have their own codex. Maybe if someone knows the password, they have to let him in no matter what. Also, Hermione, what are you doing in our common room? Come on. Or in our dormitory. I mean, why would it not be valid, right? Not like I could have done anything to invalidate it, really. But thanks for checking. Yeah, maybe. I didn't know that puts you into a different spot. Because I thought, I, yeah, I think I usually spawn in defense against the Dark Arts, exactly. Yeah, I probably saved. Yeah, that's probably why. That's why it put me in a different spot than I'm used to. That must be it. That explains it. Kind of dumb how much time I lost because of that. Because I was confused, but oh well. Oh, for Neville's punishment? Just never net let Neville in again. <laughs> yeah, homeless Neville, exactly. Whoops. Homeless Neville would be kind of sad, though. I think he already has enough of a rough time in Hogwarts. Don't think he needs uh, needs to have it even worse. Come on. Hello. You have no sound when playing. Probably didn't set up the capture card properly then. 
Have to probably select the uh, source, the sound source, like something different. Also, this ingredient hunt is the worst. I hate it a lot. Maybe we can save time here though. Like we're only 40 minutes ahead of fake's PB, so that's not good. Do think don't think there is a chance back. this PB is. Yo, Texan. 13 months, 12 months in a row. Holy shit, a year in a row. Yo, 13 months already. That's quite insane. Thank you so much for that. Also, congrats to all of your speedrunning PBs lately in HP. How's it going, man? Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Yeah, there's no mission with Hagrid and Daig and Ellie. That's kind of sad. I'm, I'm really, I'm really sad about that. <laughs> it's always the most fun mission. Hagrid gets drunk. We do some death-defying challenges. You know. I've been trying to not just do Quidditch World Cup. Yeah, I've, I've seen that. Pretty cool though. I mean, Quidditch World Cup is a nice game as well that way too few people speedrun, to be honest. I mean, it's not the best run of all time, but you know. Um, okay, let's make sure they don't bite me. Yep, and that's only what happened in like the third year, right? Not to mention the first year when he was like burned by Quirrell, at least in this game. In the challenge when he uh, when he fell off his broomstick in flying lesson. Okay, this looks decent right now. No, they attack. Oh no, they attack Ron. That's fine. Ron and Hermione being meat shields. Oh, I can't. No, that's bad. No, that's bad. Well, it looked so good, but then I went too close. Maybe. Please, please. Okay, that's fine. Doxy eggs are the worst. Like this is okay, actually. Yeah, Neville's school year really does suck. <laughs> the poor guy. It is it is kind of relaxing for sure. Like that's that's definitely a thing for Quidditch World Cup. It's a really chill run. That you can and it's also not super long as long as you don't don't do Hando, so you can just do it whenever you have like half an hour of time. Or maybe even five minutes for the Hogwarts Cup. Yeah, that's true. I'm sure for Neville stuff turns around quite heavily after HP5. After the confidence boost. The redeem for Neville. <laughs> Great hashtag. Better hashtag, well... Nah, it's not, the, the better hashtag is still not my Hagrid, but that's that's a good one. I'm, I'm fine with making that a big hashtag as well. Re re redemption for Neville or something. <laughs> You'll do it eventually. Hey, that's cool though. More people on the, lead, on the leaderboard would be great. It's only Zolly and me so far. We need some, we need some more people on there. Uh, can you please dismount? Can you please dismount? What the fuck? Can you please dismount? Actually though, wow, that took you a while. Buckbeak is such a broken mess. It's crazy. I actually don't think Hagri Harry ever told him. Harry has too much of an ego for that, honestly, Wolfie. I, I kind of doubt he's ever told him. Yep, of course that didn't work. No, not this one again. I hate this minigame. Like, you can't aim at anyone specific. I know you're not supposed to aim at the ones that are getting up, like going upwards, but you literally can't influence that. Yeah, why does he not simply do Axio flying seahorses? That's a good point. I mean, I guess he's doing carpet flying seahorses. Kind of seems a bit more painful for the poor things. Yeah, I guess I guess in the books it is a fourth year spell, even though it doesn't seem like it should be, honestly. Don't tell that to Buckbeak or, or he will kill you. Pretty sure it's a he, right, Buckbeak? I think Buckbeak knows that he's a broken mess, let's be honest. Whoops. <laughs> Axio spellbook. Axio, Axio spellbook. Is it even? It's not Axio, right? That's how they say it in HP4 PC, so I kind of go with that, but I'm pretty sure it's Akio. Hey, nice, Jumbo. That uh, means you have all the emotes and you get more channel points and everything. So enjoy. And you have the li little bean in front of your name, which is nice. In 7.1 movie, they didn't recreate Neville's broken look. Oh, yeah, he did have the. Did he have long hair in the books? I actually don't remember that. They gave him they gave him quite some bruises though, to be fair. They did recreate that at least. They they didn't give him the different haircut. I didn't even remember that, honestly. That he was supposed to have a different haircut in the books. Rebel Neville. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Hmm. <laughs> Those are the real questions here, Prince. I mean, Harry, Harry tar uh, jinxes his fireball to him, which over like a really long distance, to be fair. I mean, there's got to be some li some limit. You can't just be like Axio, I don't know, jacket that I that I lost somewhere in South Africa. Like that's probably a bit too far. Oops. They are dragonflies. Literally missed all of them. Let's go. Even missed the thing. This is like a really dumb section. I have such a hard time telling when they're moving. I got one of them at least. That's something. Oh, they're moving. Come on, do the fire. Good. Is that all? Do we have a potion? Of course not. Do you have a potion? Limit saying there's no limits. And limit must know. Well, that sucks. Hermione just suicided. Well, I mean, I kind of suicided Hermione, but uh, not my fault. Look at how dramatic she's there, though. Look at how dramatic she's fainting. <laughs> oh. oh, God. Don't kill me again. Go back at it. Where's the dragonfly? I don't see anything in this game. Okay, we got it. There we go. There we go. That was really bad and took, like, way longer than it should have. This is, like, one of the worst parts, honestly. What was wrong with Hermione? I think she might have dropped to zero health because I ran into the fire with her. Suiciding someone else is called murder? No, no, no. I don't think so. I, it was an accident, okay? I made her go into the fire, but I didn't know it would kill her. Who, who could have known that fire hurts? I didn't. I guess we all live and learn. I don't, I don't mind the lighting. I think the lighting is fine. Might look a bit weird because it's like on actual hardware and it's like capture card, but I think it's okay. The Kinect is not picking up your hands. Oh no. Isn't that the one thing the Kinect is supposed to do? That's not great. She went for a quick nap, for a quick faint in like the most, the most hysterical way properly, the most dramatical way. I guess that's probably actually the uh, official name of it, Don't Put. Yeah, that's probably how they would call it. You're on 820? Yeah, it's fucking mental, Hans. What the fuck? <laughs> like, what on earth? Almost double 420, that's true. Quick math. <laughs> what we learned today, if fire can kill you. Yeah, I, I was not aware. I swear your honor, I did not know fire hurts. <laughs> You think that would go through in, on, in court? Awesome, man. This was a shitty, shitty segment again. I'm not happy with this run, but it's okay. Like, the Glacier skip was nice. We learned a bit more of Lumos. Like, I, I feel prepared for the 100% run, but... Not, like, super happy with this. The last enemy to defeat is Math. That should have been on the Potter's Grave in Godric's Hollow. Instead of, like, the last enemy to defeat is Death or whatever they said. No, that was a different grave, wasn't it? That wasn't the Potter's, was it? I don't actually know. One million. Yeah, road to one million gift subs. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I wonder if there's anyone on any Twitch channel that has a million gift subs. Because I have a hard time imagining that, right? Like, <laughs> that seems pretty un impossible. Yeah, that's pretty sick, Hans. That's pretty, that's pretty nice. Congrats on that. So I technically don't really pay for it. Yeah, the stock market pays for them. I don't know if I split here. No, I... No, I do. I do. Now we have Quidditch straight after. He who must not be named. Yep, that is the last enemy to be defeated. Let's be real. Draco, hang on. I want to talk to you about our plan in like a public corridor way too loud. Do you have time for that, Draco? The cup's ours! Like, he, literally, I think this is the loudest Malfoy has ever talked in this entire game. And of course it happens when he's about to uh, 
to, to unveil his evil plan. <laughs> you got there, Hans. That's the important part. You got there in the end. The flower pot haircut. Hey, flower pot haircut is the easiest to do. Literally, just take your take your kitchen pot and just cut around it. Easy. Uh, okay, Ron, please. Need to close the account when you relocate. Oh, uh, wait, really? You have to? That's weird. Why is that a thing you have to do? Why did they reveal where they hit the balls? That's a good question. I guess Malfoy couldn't help it but talk about the balls. Uh, I don't know. It's just, just plot convenience, I guess. It is very dumb. They shouldn't talk about their evil plan in this public corridor to begin with. Let's be honest. Maybe that's why the Slytherin's plans always fail. Maybe that's why Dumbledore also always fails. Oh, it's taxation, I see. So you save money with it, I see. That makes sense. Look, there it is. It is. Yeah, it is there indeed, Ron. But we can't get to it from here. <laughs> the only way to get yep, to they're it hiding their balls in the courtyard. Or I don't even know what this is supposed to do. I didn't pay too much attention during the, of, of Malfoy's talk. But if they... Oh, they, they swapped out the balls, right? Against, like, jinxed ones or something. This is also such a bad hiding place. Like, it's so much in, in plain sight. It's just out in the open. Like, who thought this is a good place to hide stuff? <laughs> Come on, Malfoy. You can do better than this. Or evil plan to conquer oh, Delmanhorst. I don't know why we would do that, though. Like, what do you want in Delmanhorst? There's nothing there. It's not even worth conquering, honestly. God, Ron is so slow. The first time when you don't have Harry anymore, you finally realize how much faster he is. Like, holy shit. Yeah, it's exactly like that. Yeah, let's just hide it in the middle of, like, a courtyard that everyone gets past. Literally, to get to the Quidditch match, everyone has to get okay. through that courtyard. Well, actually, maybe not. Maybe they would take the other way. <laughs> I don't think Buckbeak has the cloaking device, though. I would be really impressed if he does, but... Don't, don't think so, sadly. So it's not quite like the Ford Anglia. Hey, who knows, Nor? Like, it's actually interesting to know, the, or like to look at the development of cities. We don't really have much here that would warrant that, but who knows? Who knows how it looks in a couple of hundred years? How's the yo, uh... E-Girl Stink? That's, that's a great name. <laughs> Welcome in. Um... It's a it's a cool game. I, I really enjoy this casually. I'm not really good at it at the speedrun, but we're getting better. We're practicing a bit. Hope you're doing well. Also, don't land on the stairs. For some reason that breaks the mission. Not sure why. I need to get to the Quidditch ball crate. I mean it would still be the same issue though, right? Like wasn't the biggest part of the issue that Hagrid uh, could not just free Buckbeak because otherwise he would get into trouble. Otherwise he could have just he could have just let Buckbeak fly away anyways and do his own thing, but Hagrid had to, you know, not get in trouble. That's why they needed to go to the length they had to go to. Got it. That the Ministry people saw Buckbeak in the field, so they knew they knew that Hagrid didn't free him, essentially. Yeah, that is true, Dor. It is really like I, I I I mean I don't live in Oldenburg for that long yet, only like four years. But my birth city, or like the, you know the city I grew up in for 18 years, it's so weird to come back to it every now and then because my parents still live there, and then realize like how much stuff is just different now. Like it's really weird. How many shops are in different places? Just completely different houses. Yeah, for sure. No, not this month, Hans. If you if you reach that at some point, that's obviously very sick. But don't do that this month, even though it's September. That's too many. Also, I actually wonder how the batch looks. I have to admit, I wonder how the 1K batch looks. I don't, I don't think I've ever seen that anywhere. I guess not as a surprise. Kind of insane. Yeah, they, he, Buckbeak fled when they were inside, exactly, fled, you know, Buckbeak somehow managed to flee himself, what a guy. You have seen the thousand gift badge? <laughs> I love that emote so much. People clap is perfect. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, bot is smart, princess. <laughs> Can't outsmart the bot. I mean, you could probably put like a super long thing in there, and if there's like no space, it probably works. Like it just cuts it off after the space. Also, this is a thing where the game can crash. So let's not do that. Let's make sure the game doesn't crash, shall we? No, oh, depressed Harry is depressed. Hmm. Interesting. Didn't I thought he wanted to focus on PC games to grind for partner, but okay. <laughs> Fair enough, Liam. Or is he doing it offline? Okay, I think we've waited long enough. This should work without a crash. Nice. No, I am not natively in Oldenburger. Nope. Ah, uh, he's doing it on Discord, I see. That makes sense. Oh, did Hagrid actually say that? That's some nice timing. Also, why is he in this cutscene? Why is Hagrid creeping around in the, in the background? See, they, I told you it would work. I told you the bot wouldn't mind. Um, yeah, we'll see what, what you guys can find with the route. If you make that faster, God. I will have to learn that before, like, Saturday, really. If that route s suddenly becomes faster. <laughs> so please don't. You know, PlayStation 2 HP2 can be can go down a bit, but please don't make it faster than Xbox. Okay, thanks. Oh no, they're going to execute Buckbeak. We had so many adventures together. Yeah, all the day skips would be are gonna be annoying, but I guess I guess at least there is gameplay in that game, unlike or in that category, unlike in any percent. Yeah, I agree with Volky. I think I think we're good with the Hagrid commands. Yeah, I'm not an old burger. I'm I'm a new burger. Yep. Yep. You don't want Hans to cancel the command. I don't really know how to cancel it, but I mean, I don't want to. It's a cool command. Also, someone talked about the security trolls earlier. We've reached that segment, but there are. Really, that was early. They are thankfully quite stupid, so you can actually get past them quite well. How did that guy ca catch me as well? What the fuck? I, I got double caught by two trolls. That was weird. Yeah, it's definitely more humane to chop someone's head off than just using a Vata Kedavra. That is actually... Oh god, I don't do that, Harry. That is actually a thing I've never thought about, but you have a point. Like, if you... How is he seeing me there? Yeah, now I now I start hating the trolls as well. What the fuck? It's not that hard. Fair enough, uh, honey badger. Welcome in. Yeah, Buckbeak's PC controls just kind of suck because of the collision. It's kind of 3D Flappy Bird with really bad collision. See, there you go. It's not that hard. Just wait a little. Freaking idiot. Um, hello. Dude, please just get cast at the troll. Cast at the troll. Thank you. That took a while. I don't think you can aim at them. Yeah, Harry's aim like is literally the biggest the biggest target you can ever find and Harry manages to miss. I mean, I managed to miss, but still. Okay, well, we got there, I guess. That was bad, like really bad. Mm, oh well. <laughs> sounds sounds like a good YouTube shorts title, Henry. Troll in the dungeon. Sirius Black in the dungeon. I hope I called for them. Should be fine. Yep, staircase is here. Perfect. This one is not here. That's weird. Why did the first one work but not the second? Hello? Can you please? Thank you. I love how staircases are the biggest trolls in like any Harry Potter game. You do, you do. I'm still, I'm still probably gonna update the chess one, even though it's like not really what I do on my channel. Like we don't really play chess, obviously, but I think I'll still upload that one. And the secret storage, the secret bean storage. I hope in Hogwarts Legacy there's gonna be like beans as well. I mean, there's not gonna be Ron sadly, but I hope they have beans, so you can actually make your very own secret bean storage. Also, this is the best part of the game, legitimately. Look at this. Look at those colors. Hogwarts Legacy Bean Boozled. Oh, yeah. You can make your character eat a Bertie Bot's bean, and, like, if it's a bad one, he gets sick. <laughs> or they get sick. 
That would be kind of funny, actually. Uh, I don't actually know where we're going. I guess just Hagrid's hut, right? Also, I kind of have to say it, but I don't think there is a chance we PB this anymore, unfortunately. It looks really cool. I really like the Night Hogwarts. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, maybe there's like a Weasley, like Ron's grand grandparent parent or so that's also called Ron. <laughs> and that's the way they get him into the game. Yeah, I don't think sub-15 is going to happen. We lost too much on Lumos and on the other skips, really. Uh, there isn't. They just said 2022. We're desperately waiting for new information, but nope, so far there's nothing really. How could they? <laughs> Ron is sad. I love how, how quickly Ron forgets about it though, you know. Oh no, they killed Buckbeck. Anyways, here's Scabbers. Let's chase him. What? Is he kicking the dog? What the fuck, Ron? Not really effective either. Let's be honest. Yeah, this is like only one more level really and a whole bunch of cutscenes, but I really don't think we have a chance to PB this. <laughs> Suddenly serious. Seriously uh, scaring Ron, I'm sure. Pretty serious jump scare. Dude, who would kick a dog like that? Like, what the fuck, Ron? Jesus Christ, that was a interesting sound. What happened there? Why did they explode? <laughs> Why did they explode? Didn't know that's a mechanic. Yep. The, I, whenever I have the chance to make the serious joke, it's not even a joke anymore because it's really not funny, but whenever I get the chance, I'll, I'll, I'll do it. It's a seriously bad joke, you could say. Can you die? Thank you. Dude, those things are so annoying. Turning into a serious problem. Yep, those puns are turning into a serious. Can you guys like chill? That was it's really slow. Um, Hermione, why am I just doing this? We just need Hermione for the stupid thing. I always die during this at least once, usually, so let's... Oh, she's like super low health. How did that happen? I guess the red caps just attacked her. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. She's gonna die, like, once we fight the other salamanders for sure. Oops. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't look like he's casting, that's true. Maybe he is backhand slapping them. That's what they do as well, you know? Gotta do the same to them as they do to us. Okay, Hermione, please just don't die. I don't have a potion or anything, so... This is bad. <laughs> yep, instantly dead. I thought so. I don't know what I'll do here, because she's gonna respawn without health either. That's actually really bad. I should have made a potion or something. Um... Yeah, I don't quite know how to beat this. This is gonna lose so much time. Yeah, sub 215 is dead. Dude, full series me was actually better than me right now. Also, rip. Rip your points. Or is there one here, though? I don't think there is one here to even get... Oh, no, there is. This drops potions? Yep. Yep, bean. Yep, bean. Nope. Hermione's still- where is Hermione? Wait, is she still- oh, she's not dead anymore. Okay, that's good. I don't know if I can beat this, actually. Like, she's just gonna keep on dying. I- I- I don't think I can- this is so dumb. Why would you- what is this game design? Why would you respawn them without any health? What if both die? Is that- does that respawn me or something? This is terrible. Like, who thought about this? Does this respawn me? Oh, thank god. Okay, at least there's a way to get the health back. I should have done that from the beginning. I didn't know that's like how it worked. Oh, we're back here. Fuck's sake. That is really poor design though. Like, come on, man. Just don't make me respawn without any health. Like, that literally doesn't do anything. What? He was frozen. And no, he's not anymore. 
This game is annoying me like a little bit, but it's okay. Can't PB all every, and I can't always PB. It's important that we get practice for Hundo, so whatever. That we've definitely gotten today, so that's something. Oh, this bridge is still there. Oh, interesting. That stays apparently, but the Salamanders don't. <laughs> okay. That was the reason I quit HP1 PlayStation 2. Do they also respawn you without any health? Or what? Which reason? I'm a bit confused. Don't feel like the game does that. Like, I think the game just respawns you completely, right? Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just confused. Alright, enjoy your food on. See you around. Dude, this segment is so not fun. I mean, if you die during Crow, uh, it puts you like super far back, which is annoying. I agree with that, but at least you spawn with full health, right? Yeah, not getting two world records again. I mean, not even getting a PB. This is like actually a sad run. This run really sucks. Oh, you do? You do? Re oh, yeah, you do respawn with half your health. No, you do. That's a good point. You do. Yeah, no, I can see that. That's that's fair. It's a really weird mechanic. Like, why would you do that? If you kill the player off, at least let them spawn with, like, full health so they have a chance to beat the game. <laughs> really? Oh, no. Hermione's poison. Are they just gonna die? I don't know if, the, if Hermione's... Yeah, Hermione's just gonna die. Okay. I, I Oh, I need her here. Oh, my God. This is so annoying. Oh, she's not dead. Okay, we're fine. We're all good. I don't know if you... Maybe you can't die from poison or something like that. You can die from poison. Hey, I don't appreciate the good luck and I hope you're doing well. Um, yeah, this game is now officially like... Oh, this run is now officially even worse than it was before. I'm gonna drink the potion. Oh, that's just an antidote? Feck off, man. I need an antidote. Yeah, I'm pretty certain that you can die from poison. I don't know what told me, but I'm pretty sure you can. Wait, I don't have the educational tag. Did they reset my tags? Oh, that's sad. I need to re-put them back in place them. Sometimes Twitch does that, which is really annoying. You mean with the prediction? Yeah. Yeah, believing in me today. I thought I could get a, get a PB, but... Sadly, it turns out like it was the wrong decision. Satch. Hello? I'm gonna die here, like, 20,000 times. Oh yeah, those are one hit, I remember. What? No, I didn't do that. What? Oh, Harry, how did Harry die? I didn't even get, I didn't even get hit. Dude, this game is actually so annoying if you have no health on this level. This is not designed well. <laughs> I can't die with a mining now either, because that puts me, like, all the way back. But we can kind of snipe it. Why am I getting damage? What is poisoning me? There's no one around. I don't have a potion. Dude, this is so weird. Like, how do I keep on getting poisoned or whatever? Or, like, stink pelleted? They literally nobody was around to attack me. Oh, Hermione does have a potion? Okay, I don't really care, though. It's fine. We've done it now. Stupid level, man. Like, actually shit level. Yeah, thanks, Hermione. That was needed. Fuck you. <laughs> what the fuck? Why? <laughs> Literally no point. That was next level friendly fire. Yes, snakes welcome in. Poison? He's been poisoned? We should play HP6 in English again, honestly. Maybe I complained too much about this level that Hermione wanted to shut me up. Shut me up. Or she's also like someone with a Polyjuice Potion. Also, those spells were really risky. <laughs> One centimeter to the right and Ron's plans for children would be uh, probably gone. Do I split here? As they marched I guess, Hogwarts, probably. The full moon rose, and Professor Lupin transformed into a werewolf. Yeah, I mean, Sirius and Lupin have pretty decent character mods, but they're also the same as on PC, so, yeah. Oh yeah, we have no health, so I should, I should just instantly suicide on the Dementors. That's a good point, actually. 
Because uh, we're gonna we're gonna get caught by the Dementor anyways at some point. It's literally like impossible to avoid. So, yep. What is oh Sirius is like he's he's cold. I see. I was like, what is he doing? But that makes sense. Oh, you can't. Okay, so you actually can avoid it. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I'm not gonna tempt fate. Pansy in third movie? I don't actually know how she looks. I just know how she looks in the, in the later ones, kind of. Don't remember in the early ones. Come on, Dementor. Kill me. Dude, I didn't... Oh, okay, I'm dead. Cool. Yeah, bit slow because we have to watch this cutscene again of Hermione running, but... Yeah. This part is annoying. And the final boss fight is also annoying. I 100% agree. They're, they're both really dumb. <laughs> In really awful parts. Run, Miney. Exactly. Hermione practicing for the marathon. She doesn't even notice that there are Dementors here. She just doesn't care. I mean, it looks quite nice. I, obviously, it's just a PNG. You can tell on the trees as well. But it does look quite okay. And Esaku, thank you for the good luck. Welcome in. Yeah, I, I do all the 23 of the series. Uh, the Game Boy Color ones are quite fun. They're not a great speedrun because they're very much based on luck, right? Um, and we don't really have manipulations that much. So they're they, they quite, uh, quite rough to speedrun, but every now and then I do them. They're quite fun. Yeah, on small TVs it's not too bad for sure. All right, time for some Patronus action. I've actually recently learned 100% uh, for those games as well, for the GBC games. Which are quite interesting runs. Which I really have to come back to at some point. That did not work. This part is fun. <laughs> totally not boring and just long. We have 8 minutes to finish this, there's no way, right? There's too much cutscenes even. This is like, the fact that this is close to a PB though is so sad though, because it was so bad. Like, it was such a terrible run. Oh, you actually have a few inmates escape the prison. That's pretty monk ass to be fair, but hope they can catch them soon. That is a real life Azkaban. Yeah, I don't think there is any chance either, to be fair. But it's actually still like somewhat close. And again, that's like really weird how that's possible. Can you be done, please? Like, I do like the controls of the spell. Well, the controls are shit, but I do like the idea that you are kind of the Patronus. It's kind of cool. Yeah, that's fair, Hans. They've probably left the kind. If they could, they've probably left the kind. I don't know how, uh, how fortified the borders are, essentially. How much controls there are. Don't know how hard it is to get out of the country. Nah, the mentors are just the mentors. <laughs> They're just kind of chilling. They're just their own thing, really. Now captured, serious A serious rescue. Oh, that's so much better. Yeah, that's so much better, then. That is such such a nice name, actually. Gold. Twenty nine seconds saved. I don't really know how because we even died. Like this makes no sense. But okay, maybe I split in a wrong spot or whatever. What we need. It's more time. Wink. No, he's not winking. Come on, Dumbledore. Dumbledore was giving them permission to use the time turner she'd been using all year to attend several lessons at once. We're going to use the time kind of forgot this game as a narrator. <laughs> Since uh, friends must work together, I kind of didn't hear anything about him. I mean, it is actually like surprisingly close, and that's really dumb. It shouldn't be close after this run. It was like I, I can push this down by so much, man. By like an easily ten minutes. Like I can probably even get a sub three if everything goes like super well. A sub two rather. Friends must work together. I w I'm missing the no me mode after that. That would have been perfect. Dumbledore looks like Santa. Santa Albus. 
I mean, to be fair, Dumbledore, he comes in a lot of forms, a lot of ways and forms. Some say he even, he's, he even goes by the name of Gandalf sometimes. So he might as well go by the name of Santa Claus as well. Oops, wrong, wrong button. Albus Santador, yeah, that's probably the better name for him. Show bonsai, alright, we have some cutscenes at the end where I can show the bonsai. Okay, that was a good start. Team bonsai, yep. Why did they turn Hermione blonde? Yep, that's the thing that nobody knows. Okay, that's fine. We got rid of a lot of Dementors, actually. That's not bad. Dude, it's so dumb when they spawn in your way. Like, there's nothing you can do to prevent that. If you spawn the Patronus and they're just there. Like, literally dumb. Eat. Nah, it's not. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, really, I'm gonna uh, roll for it on street, like during the ra uh, race or the tournament. Like I don't know it yet either. It's gonna be quite interesting to see. One more, I think, or is it two more? I don't know. All I know is that this fight sucks. How much cutscenes are there? Is it two, four minutes of cutscenes? Is that it? Yeah, makes sense. But uh, we actually got a fairly okay fight. Like, only had to recast like twice. Or two, two, two or three only didn't hit. That's pretty solid. That's pretty solid. I'll take this. But I don't think we can finish this within like three minutes, can we? Hey, perfect timing, mate. How was your Valorant? Hope you got some nice, some nice rounds. <laughs> I mean that can't happen. That would be that would be kind of funny as well. No, it's it's got to be all eight games separately. Eight eight times HP one. Oh boy. Thanks for the GGs. I mean we're pretty much done. There's like one more travel on Buckbeak and then a shitload of cutscenes and then we're pretty much done. Um. So we'll see. It works. Pog you. Should be fun to watch. You think it's sub 215? Really? Uh, is it that few cutscenes? <laughs> Dude, if this PBs, I, I I, don't even know how this would PB. Dude, did you see the freaking... Did you see the freaking, like, Willow? That was so bad. Mm, that's just Harry Potter time traveling for you, Chris Sudern. It's quite... I'm sure there's quite a few YouTube videos about it. Whoops. Should be good. Dang. I mean, I was a kind of a dodgy buck beak, but that's good to know. Or good to hear. Is there actually hope for the believers? Question mark. Imagine it would have crashed now on this stutter. <laughs> I mean, it's hard to get lost on the way to Sirius, to be fair. Depends on how early Dumbledore is going to talk to us, I guess. I know McNair reappears. Like, I know he's on the graveyard in HP4 as well, right? And uh, I'm pretty sure he's also, like, in the Ministry of Magic in HP5. Maybe not in HP5, but... I know that McNair actually appears quite often in the... Well, not quite often, but... I know that he appears in the books, at least. How's your Donald? Welcome in. <laughs> That's a good guess. It's as good as a guess of, as any other, you know. I think it will be possible. Maybe. Like, there isn't much left of cutscenes. Right? Is there? It's just talking to Dumbledore, isn't there? Dude, this does not deserve a PB. I can so I can so easily beat this, man. I'm not even happy with this, even though it's PB somehow. <laughs> like this was not good. Oh well, eventually we'll beat this by a lot. But it's a PB for now if Dumbledore talks to us. A rerun. We can do one soon if anyone requests it again. This was a requested run, so. Always like I should honestly do more Xbox because all my times are just bad and I can beat all of them by like a lot. Oh, he talks quite a while though. Is it sub 15 though? Mm, this cut seems long. Okay. Yes, that was a quick Dumbledore. Pock. Sub 2 I can do, I think. Just need a really good run for that. Well, Pock for the believers. This somehow PB'd. <laughs> Thanks for the GG's. 
I did not expect that at all. Like, this was not a good run. Thanks for resolving the prediction. Enjoy your points. That was a good prediction as well. Very, um, you know, people on both sides, really. Dang. Yeah, really surprised. Charlie with 16,000 points. Dang, that's going to be a nice payout. Let's go. Enjoy. He believed even though you didn't vote. Fair enough. I guess you were a bit too late, probably. Uh, yeah, let's watch this outro. I'll tr in the background, probably gonna set up the next run because we're do gonna do a nice HP1 meme run. Oh, there is not much of an outro.